Okay, that should work. I don't know what the fuck that was all about. That was a little weird. I don't know why OBS decided to just deselect my microphone that I've used for the past fucking, like, three weeks. Actually, it's because I restarted my computer last time. Never mind. I do know. I do remember. What's up, Raccoon? How's it fucking going? Uh, ignore the bed behind me. I'm doing sheets. So I can't really... can't really do anything about that. But uh, hi, what's up? How's it going? Hair. Fucking... Ah. <laughs> you know, I'm working with it today. We're gonna... We're gonna see where this... Today takes us with the hair. Honestly... I don't know. I don't know, we'll give it some, we'll give it some style. I don't know why I always fucking work with my hair now on stream. It's just, it's like, uh, fun for me. I don't, I don't know. But, Paper Mario Day! Ha <laughs> ha, yay! It's the second last one before, uh, all the completion stuff. So. What's up, Luma Speed? How is it? No, I don't want, I don't want that. I don't, no game capture. Oh, fuck. Wrong thing. There we go. What's fucking going on, ladies and gentlemen? Sorry, I'm later than I wanted to be, but I had to do some stuff. Um, like, not chores-wise, but like I had to get some stuff done before I started streaming today so that they were done, especially because I work another long shift tomorrow. So... It was, you know, important that I got them done. So, yeah. Also, you know, chapter 7 of this fucking great game. 23 hours into the game. Which is fucking wild to me. that It's been 23 hours worth of streams here. That was Dire Dire Docs. That was Dire Dire Docs music you guys heard. It was the first song in a random fucking YouTube video I saw. And I, I like Dire Dire Docs. I like it. So, um, last time we finished chapter six in one sitting. Very boring chapter, almost fell asleep. Today, we're going to go to the moon. And finish this chapter, which means tomorrow is going to be a big day, but not tomorrow. In two days, we're going to, you know, start collecting 100%, which I'm really excited for. So, star pieces and, like, all the different, like, challenge bouts and everything. So, pretty exciting. And tomorrow, it's day one of Luigi's Mansion 3. A long time ago, in 2004, this game was made. It's true. And that was 17 years ago. Which is fucking crazy. 17 years ago? It's a little wild, don't you think? I think so. I definitely think so. <clears throat> it is stupid cold out here. Come on, Gonzalez. Let's move. Far up post should be just up ahead, I think. Okay. That was an accident. I assumed that it was over here. I just... You know, accidents were made. But it worked out for the better. So, for those who don't know, I'm actually really far on star bits. I'm like... I got 54 out of the 100, so we're doing pretty good. Me gets born. I don't know. Is this guy okay? He is... He's fine. The chapter of the fun task of going after General White. Oh. I don't remember what General White is, but I do remember that name not being associated with good stuff. Nine at fucking nine house. What the fuck? 
I mean, nothing I can't deal with, but still, what the hell, dude? No one needs all that health. Except me. When I do... anything. Because honestly, 9 health, psh, that's more than enough. I feel like... I have a feeling that I can't hit her. But we're gonna try. I was right. But, now, maybe I try as Mario. No, didn't work either. I thought maybe because I had the spike shield that would work. But I was wrong. Simply wrong. Alright, Goombella, this is where you shine. Good job, good job. Yeah, but how, how's everyone's day being gone? I, like I said, my day has been kind of nothing but work. You know, I went to bed and slept with my dogs on the couch. Because they were downstairs by themselves. And I cuddled up all next to them, all sweet-like. So that was nice. On top of that, um, on top of that, I had to wake up at 7.30. I woke up at 8.30, but that's fine. Just to go take my dogs out. And then I went back to sleep for a little bit. Woke up again, got dressed, got my shower. Or got, well, in that order, sure. I got had my clothes on in the shower. Then I went to work at 12, and I got home two hours ago. So. I got some sick-ass collectibles at a video game thrift store. That's cool. My day's just fine. Been watching YouTube. That's the, that's, that's the dream, ain't it? What kind of stuff did you get? At the, the thing. Frost Piranha. I like it. I like it. Damn. Goombella's taking all the shots for me today. I appreciate it, though. I do appreciate it. Day two in a row of me having McDonald's for dinner. It might be day three tomorrow. I don't know. I don't know. I got an Atari video game with its boxed. Two Game Boy games, Super Mario Land and Donkey Kong Land. You own a Game Boy? That's cool. And an Atari ERE video game. That, you know, that's a fucking pretty cool thing to get there. Some pretty cool things to get. Showstopper. I'm gonna... See, here's the problem. I do a lot of damage here. Uh, I can actually... No, it's just the high numbers scare me. I can actually kill these guys in two turns. Never mind, I'm fine. Yeah, I'm, I'm just fine. Nice block. Not time for the Kaleco version in Super Mario Brothers. Duck Hunt for the NSS. No, I don't have a Game Boy. Got this off for 45 CAD. Cool. Why do you keep with pixel threats? I don't know. Canadian dollar is $1.25 USD. So that's... So for every $4, that's an additional dollar, basically. I mean, if you give that a testament, so 40 bucks would be 50 bucks. So 45... So for me, that's like, I think five, $52.50 or something. If I had to do random math in my head. Nice. Hold on, Sufan. I'll eat in one second. Let me just fucking kick these guys' ass real quick. 
Mini game costs 80 bucks and we do pay $5 extra. 80 bucks is kind of crazy though. This is gonna, that's like 20 experience right there. Wow, that's, that was good. I quite enjoyed that. Can I get the fucking badge? Thank you. All right, food time. New snack. Technically, no one fucking got snacks yesterday. I was a little disappointed. Fig Newtons. That is the wrong direction. Fig Newtons. They're like cookies. Fucking good. This guy's a Fig Newton enthusiast. Right here. Fig Newton enthusiast. Got one fig in this hand. One fig in this hand. And me just eating them. You gotta love it. What? Oh. I have to ignore these. Random. Fucking problems with the emulator. I, I, I swear, I get so many fucking... I get so many fucking... Um, uh, errors when I'm playing this game. So this is Far Outpost. I wonder where the cannon that shoots the moon is. I guess we should start by talking to the villagers, don't you think? There's a hundred percent a thing here. I like I could feel it in my fucking bones. The question is where though? What direction is it? Sounds like he needs to calm down. If you want, I'll mail Miss Kissa with you. What the fuck are you guys talking about in chat? Sorry, let me correct. What the fuck is Soup Fan talking about in chat? I'm very confused. I'm like, I... I'm confused. What business do you have here? What a cannon! No such thing is here. What? Listen, we definitely heard there was a cannon around here. What do you want from me to say? We don't have one. Then what's this? Okay, well that didn't work. Oh, shit. That brings us even closer. Soup fan, stop being fucking weird. Please. Please stop being weird. Wait, wait, wait. Go back in there. There was a star piece. I saw, I saw it. Okay. Uh, 
Um. Shit. Snowman and glue snow fights to all gold. But snow gets boring sometimes. Kaboom! I make big snow bob today. Maybe I win. Maybe I biggest him someday. Papawi! But I do not want melting to happen to me. Papoom! Papoom! Hello, traveler. First time in Far Outpost. Kabooey! What? Far Outpost Cannon? Why? Well, I apologize for that. No, I just had distraction. It is nothing. Kabooey! Good to know. Good to know. Good talk. Good talk. This is Bobom Village, Da Bluey! There is nothing here, Da Blamo! Welcome to Far Outpost! Whoa! What is quite good lip warmer you got there? Okay, I now give you my special mustache viewing personality analysis, Da. Ah, hmm, Da, Da, hmm, Da, Da, I have got it now. Your pussy broom means that you are stubborn and selfish man. So how did I do? No, do not protest. I know, no one likes to admit their faults. Snow is rare for you. Bakak! In Far Outpost, it falls all year round. Ba bang! I like watching it shine in glow of sunset. Ba bomber! Very well spoken. These are all poets all of them are poets what I did not did not did I not tell you we have no steely cannon now listen here that's not his voice I don't remember what his voice was old boy I know I saw a cannon the last time I was here so don't you not lie now sir Shh, you call yourself a babum I spit at you you know rules there's no, there's to be mentioned no cannon to non babams No mention. We must not allow it to be used for evil. Of course I know all that, you great blowhard. But we must use that cannon to get to the moon, old boy. And if we don't, sir, the world could end. Hmm, ha, oh, world could end. Hmm, well, uh, we cannot have that now. Uh, still, you cannot use cannon right now because of uh, certain circumstances. Circumstances? We, we must have permission of Goldbomb to use cannon. He's the one who started the whole blasting things to faraway places policy. Once he got rich, he let business slide and does not start it up again. Also, General White was the one who devoted himself to operation of the cannon. But he was so depressed by losing of job that he took cannon key and left. Gold Bob and General White. Da, that is correct. But I value good morality, then why do majority serve Bowser? They don't in this. They don't in this game. I don't even think we fought a normal Bob Bomb enemy yet. We fought a big fucking fat ass bob -omb, but they don't serve Bowser. They were just in the cave. Yeah. Well, yeah. Any enemy that we fought in this game doesn't even serve Bowser. In this game, it's different. In every game, they have different moralities. Also, I'm sure that some are good and some are bad. Right? Very well, then. We can't give up now, old boy. Mario, let's go find those two. Well, once you find them, come back and talk to me. Fuck you. Alright, well, now now we gotta go fucking find the two bombs. Gold Bob's been basically everywhere we've been, so... It's just a matter of finding where he is, and then... I don't know where General White is. He's in this room. He's not in that room. Well... I knew it was locked, but I thought I might as well try. Bow, bow, bow. Excuse me. Okay. Okay. Do, 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 do. I will use 
the... Hmm... Like, I want to be able to use his bombast attack right now, but I can't because I don't have FP. Uh, but this is going to give me a level up, so I might as well go all out, right? That's kind of my idea, mentally. We can have a mutual agreement that there are regular bob bombs that can't explode without harm, and factory bob bombs which die after exploding. The former is mostly peaceful race, and the latter is loyal to whichever is the villain. I agree with that. Where is Wicked Jest? Wicked Jester stop showing up in chat after being timed out. That was two days ago. It wasn't that long ago. It was two days ago. He kept fucking being stupid. Like, say vagina, say penis. And that was the entire chat. I was just like, I'm sick of it. So I timed him out for 10 minutes. And then he doesn't like Mario Odyssey, so it makes sense why he wouldn't watch yesterday. Listen, to be fair, to be fair, I get annoyed of st both really, really, really stupid requests. I'm say Among Us backwards. See what happens. I want to know what happens when you say Among Us backwards. Or say penis. Look up, say, uh, uh, search up vagina and then show it on screen. Like, it's, it's those are dumb requests. And I don't like seeing them because they're annoying as fuck. So I timed them out. As I do to anyone else that's like, Oh, no, oh yeah, I want you to fucking uh, say penis three times and clap your hands. That's the only way we can do it. No matter if it's Luma Speed, Wicked Jester, Soup Fan, it doesn't matter. I get annoyed by it. If you do it too much, that's what's going to happen. Now, I don't see Raccoon doing it, but I feel like if a Raccoon was to, was to ask for something like that, I feel a little bit more obliged. Because that man never fucking asks anything. He's only helpful. And it would be such out of character for him to be like, mm, Say Among Us backwards. You gotta say it. You gotta say these nuts backwards. Say these nuts forwards. See what happens. Uh, what's 9 plus 10? What's 9 plus 10? Quick. That's basically what's happened. Um, what do I want to do? I don't know. It doesn't do like 17 damage. I knew it did six, but I like to hyperbole. Damn, dude. Ah, uh -huh. I think I've only gotten like four bingos in the entire game. Hold fast. I don't think I've ever used this ability. I, I fu really fucked that up. But it's okay, because it doesn't even matter in the first place. <laughs> because I'm going to level up. Which I love doing. And I level up my health. Or will I? Mm. No, let's do it. Let's do BP. Now it's all 30. Now it looks nice. Now it's cool looking. Ah! Fuck. You stepped into the wrong dojo! Ah! Would. Would. Wath a stream if Wicked Jester was doing it? You'd watch a stream if Wicked Jester was doing it. Yeah. 
Okay. That's fine. I don't really care. If he is in chat, or if any of you become annoying in chat, and I have said something before of the of the inclination that I don't like it or if it's annoying, and you continue to do it, being timed out for 10 minutes is what's going to happen. I mean, no matter who does it, that will happen. If you're political, you'll get timed out for 10 minutes. It's really simple. I, I don't understand. Just don't be annoying in chat. Or say some stupid shit. I have 5 BP. What the fuck? I... Don't know why I did that, but... Ooh, defend... Actually... This actually could be useful for defend plus. Defend plus might be the, the, the right move here. Just because, you know, one more defense is always useful. King Baban for president of the Mushroom Kingdom. Ah. Uh, mm, I think he's already got king, so I'm not sure how that would work. Can a king... Can a... Can a king... Of another country become a president of a, a diff separate country? That That's the questions we need to be asking. Truly the hard-hitting country. What country is he king of? Well, the Babam Nation. I think that's like Nevada or something. I don't... I'm not 100% sure. But he's the king, Babam. It says king. So he has to lead a country. Because you can only be king when you rule over people and a country. And have a kingdom. So, you know, my question still stands. I do know that. I did know that the dog was, um, I did know that the dog was, uh, the mayor of that one town. Bob on battlefield. I, that's but that's a battlefield. I'm not sure that's what he's king of. You know what? You know what? Let's look it up. Let's look it up together. Why is my window not showing? Tad bit confused. Hello? <sighs> what the fuck? Controller settings! Nope. What the fuck? I'm now really confused. There it is! That was weird. What is King... What is King Bob-Bomb? King Bob-Bob. King of. Hmm. King Bob-Bomb. Formerly known as Big Bob-Bomb. Is the king of the bob who debut in Super Mario 64. I didn't know that. They debuted in Super Mario 64? Really? Huh. Latest. That's right, he's in Super Rush. I believe they would still exist in Galaxy 2. Womp's Fortress is completely fine. He's got to have a fucking kingdom he rules over. Dio, what the fuck? We're, who we. What the what fucking what does he live though? What He's gotta be a king of something. What? What is this? In Bowser Jr.'s journey, King Bob appears as the boss of the level power 
where he last topical Captain Goomba. Okay. He does not appear until post-game level Mighty Melee, serving as the enemy captain for the first third round. Dr. Mario World? That's the, that's the phone game. The fuck? Paper, he's in Paper Jam? What? He might, is he not the fucking king of anything but just bombs? I feel, I feel, I feel, I feel, I feel taken away. Kelly Von Ryan, what the fuck? The Dio, I feel like this is a weird villain's wiki. I don't know why this is encompassing as as much as it is. And I'm pretty sure the background of this is Amnesia, which is a horror game. This escalated? What do you mean it escalated? I'm not sure what you mean. What what part of this is it? Fuck, my controller disconnected. There we go, we're back. What part of it escalated? Meow. Why, why did I come up here? Why why does it let me come up here? <laughs> That's kind of weird. Bob Bombs debuted in Super Mario Bros. 2. King Bomb himself debuted in. Maybe. We don't know that for sure. Why did it let me up here? Oh, for this maybe. I mean... I do like me a, an old-fashioned shine sprite. I do like me an old-fashioned shine sprite. We only need three more, and we'll have all of them to level everybody up, which is nice. All right. Oh, wow. I'm running low on these things. Um, I mean, I feel like it could probably be useful, you know. All right. I like it. So we got to find King, King, King shit, whatever his name is. Not King shit, sorry. Gold Bob. And General White. I am going to use my general deduction skills and say he's probably white. Maybe. You know, I don't know for sure. However, it's a guess in the dark. I mean, we're here. Might as well level up. You know. Nice. Alright, we'll save while we're here as well, just to make sure that, you know, that's that's done. Um, and we're all good there. But Gold Bob. You know who might have some answers? But probably doesn't have any answers? Dr. Goom Goompus. I forget, I actually forget what his name is. Still, I'm, I'm not missing anything, which is good. I went in game to test what the wiki said, and it is true. Stampede hits flying enemies, even though the game says it doesn't. Oh. Huh. You're almost done. I'm so racist to miss it. Okay, well, it's fine. You are no help. Literally no help. Yeah, and then once I beat this game, I'm planning on playing Super Paper Mario. So that's exciting. Uh, and Super Paper Mario seems to be working fine. Which is nice. But you lose your hammer ability altogether? That's... 
uh, both hilarious and a terrible badge. I love that. That's a cool fucking badge. Sorry, you don't- you can't use your hammer at all now. But, then I could do 12 damage. You know? So, I mean, could be pretty worth it. What am I doing? Okay. Back up. We know where Gold Bob is. He's in Poshley Heights. So I gotta go to Poshley Heights myself. Which is... Down here. No, well, not... Poshley Heights isn't down here, but... The route over is over here. Yes. Uh, pretty sure this left one is it. Might be the right one. I don't know, I was right. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Can I tell you my wicked ingester impression? Yeah, I mean, sure, but then you don't have to be so sassy about it. I asked you something! Dude, fuck you! Shut the fuck up! <laughs> you don't have to be dick. I asked you something! Fuck you. Gold Bob. He's not in here. There's no, there's no gold here. No need to be a dick about it, Jesus Christ. Gold Bob. Good day to you, Gonzalez. What can I do for you today? What's that you say? You must use the cannon and firearm place to save the world. Mm, well, that is rather a pickle, isn't it? Very well, then. I certainly owe you a favor, too. Hmm? Sure, so I should say. The truth is, I hope to rescue my bu resume my business with that cannon someday. And just between us, I only stopped because of the wife. She said she didn't like the noise. Sadly, it takes a hefty bit of coin to get that cannon working, so I need to demonstrate to just how much you want to use that cannon. If it were a matter of money, just how much would you pay, if I may ask? One coin. One coin? Do you mock me? Why not just slap me with your shoe and be done? Cowboy... Ugh, fuck, words. Cowboy, what the fuck is up? How's it going? This will not do, no, no. Why don't you come back later with a new attitude? Hello. Nothing. Sometimes something for nothing. <laughs> Money makes the world spin. You're a bit naive, I'm afraid. Why don't you come back once you've learned a bit about the way of the world? 64 coins. 64 coins? You seem to underestimate the value of my services. Well, I just can't abide that. Why don't you come back later, hmm? Oh, you're back. Everything, I have everything. What? You pay every coin you earn? <laughs> All of them? You are really so really? No. You're you're so you're not serious then. Well I understand. Okay, dude. I left a threat for you at your job today. You left a threat? I didn't see it. Where did you leave it? I saw, I saw, um, someone I knew. One of the drivers. Pizza man's wife. But the pizza man you don't like. Well, I suppose I'm just surprised to hear you say that. Staggered, actually. You know, that means you'll be left with zero coins. With absolutely nothing. Lo, yes, I told your tall friend. Oh, really? You talk to Andrew? That's crazy. You know that, do you? Yes. I mean, think of it, man. If you spent all your coins, and I mean all of them, you would certainly face a great deal of difficulty down the road. Just buy gold bars before doing it. No! Yes! But hold on, I want to make sure you're doing this fully aware of the consequences. Are you sure you won't regret this later? Absolutely sure. No. I'll get gold bars. I love his wife. She's so nice. She is nice. And for a second, when I said, oh, 
Hey! It almost looked like she didn't realize it was me at first. And that's just some random stranger was saying that to her. And was a asked for a hug. I was a little embarrassed. I was like... She doesn't remember who I am. Where can I buy gold bars? Because I don't, I don't remember. Uh... Probably in the sewer. Town. If I had to guess. Crash, any tips for working at pizza business? Well, I guess it depends on what... On what job you have. Right? I remember gold bars being sold at the shop at the arena with the star piece trader. Okay, I hope your supervisor saw that. Um, so, okay, so pizza tips. Pizza tip number one. There is no pizza tip. I couldn't think of a single thing to say, honestly. Um... Sorry, no, pizza tip... If, okay, pizza tip one, don't let the customers get a hand over you. If they ever think, oh, let me fucking get more sauces after I pay, because, you know, I'm going to make, I'm going to save 50 cents. No, you say, fuck you, you're paying again. Get your fucking wallet out, Susan. I want to see that dollar on my desk by now, before you get these two ranches. Scratches. Declassified Pizza Survival Guide. I love that. I love the the, the the show that was based on that. It was fucking Greg's Declassified School Guide or some shit. I love that fucking show. Soup fan the man. I love oh, right. Yeah, they destroy you. Next pizza tip. Be kind to the employees that you work with. If you're not kind, I don't expect kindness back. Third pizza tip. Always have a bag of fries near you. For when you're hungry. Final pizza tip. Don't forget... Don't forget to charge for $90 worth of water if people try to get big boys, big boy jugs, okay? That's where you get the money. I only know sandwich. Yeah, pizza. Craig still classified. Lamont Crash said no free promo. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I couldn't remember. It was, it was Ned or Greg. I couldn't. It was one of the two. Uh... I'll sell something. I've had this fucking gradual syrup forever. Same thing with this fucking power punch. Did he charge for water? He did charge for water. I did! It was $90 worth. Look, the thing was, okay. For people who don't know. I was, I was, it was like my first or second month working at the pizza place that I worked at for two years. Okay. And... Basically, what happened was, was that I was waiting on the table for cross-country kids. Now, there was like 20 of them. Um, and again, I, I'm very new to this. And the day prior, I was talking to my very Italian boss. And I, he was, he was basically saying, look, you know, when someone gets a pitcher of a liquid, what happens is, is that you have to charge for it every single time. So I took that to heart. Right? He said pitcher. He didn't say soda pitcher. He said pitcher. So I said, okay. It's in my mind. This is what we got to do. And so, you know, I'm, I'm, I, I bring out the water and I keep asking them for water. And so every time I bring more water out for them, I charge them again. And it ended up being 10 different refills on this fucking pitcher. So it came out to $90. dollars the problem was, was I, I knew this didn't feel right, so I asked, and I never got a response from my boss, who was working at the time. And so I just was like, 
All right, well, we're just gonna go through it then. And then I proceeded to bring the money out and say, hey, look, here's the thing. They're like, $90 in water. And I said, guys, I don't know. <laughs> and then I fucking, uh, then we talked to Gianluca, who is my boss. I didn't mean to say his name, but I, whatever. And he's like, what? $90 in water? And basically, basically, I got in trouble. <laughs> but I, I felt really bad. But the best part was, was they still gave me fucking $100 in tips. The freshman side of the team, which was like a 10 or 11 people, all of them together gave me $69, which was 50% tip or something. I think closer to like 60 or 70% tip because they thought it was funny. So even though I charged them $90 in water and it was fixed inevitably. Plus I fucked up their table so bad. I was so bad at waiting tables when I first began, especially of that size. I was, whew, it was a fucking shit show every time I'd have to do that. I only had to do it twice, but it was a fucking shit show. The 69 was intentional and they gave it to me and I was like, holy shit. And then the other team, the other side of the team, which was like seniors and juniors, they gave me a tip as well. That was much smaller. So I think they only gave me like 20 or 30 bucks. So I made like a hundred bucks that night. And I was like, holy shit, I could pay for their water. Did I? No. So yeah. I, I really can take them all? Really? You won't just say, just kidding, later on, or any sort of tomfoolery like that? Well, all right then. Hmm, well, you certainly shown me something, sir. So I give my permission for you to activate the far outpost cannon. Oh, and I wasn't serious earlier, my dear fellow. How could I take your money? <laughs> it's a shame, I suppose, but I'll return your money. Now, soldier, on my boy. Why were they so thirsty? Here's the thing. There was like 20 of them. So there was two pitchers between them. And I kept just going out there like, hey, do you guys want more water? And they're like, yeah, sure, yeah, sure. So I just kept giving them water. <laughs> Little did they know they fell into my fucking money trap scheme. I was fucking playing big money moves. And they were like, I'm just thirsty. I'm just a thirsty boy. And I'm like, yes, another $18 for the prey. The emails reminds me of the sad fact I don't know how to email. I mean, it's not a, it's not a thing you learn to do. It's just a, a thing. Which, where was she sniffing? I didn't see. I, I, I genuinely didn't see. Where was she sniffing? But yeah, you just have to fucking write it and be formal. Where are you? Or where were you sniffing? Nothing here, apparently. Close to the couple. Fine, we'll head back. And yeah, so that was the, um... The water story. And I already told you guys about the... The lovely green banana incident. I'm getting a Daryl Dixon ad. Who the fuck is Daryl Dixon? I just saw him on the cover of some game. Daryl Dixon? Is it... Wait, is it for Deathloop or whatever that game is? I don't know, I just feel like his name would be Daryl Dixon. The, the guy in that game. And I have no idea. I'm gonna eat a Fig Newton. Wait, no, I'm not allowed. I have to wait for you guys to tell me to eat a Fig Newton first. Damn it. I can't go back to Russia. I'm getting targeted ads, bro. So if... Oh. What game was he on the, the cover of? Wait, shouldn't I ask him where General White is? I know I'm moving back and forth, but I'm like... Now I'm thinking about it. Does he have any idea where General White is? 
Wait. Isn't General White in Koopa Town? I don't need to ask. I think that's where he is. Target ads. You love Target? I think Target's fine. I, I, I mean, I've only ever been to Target for, like, when I was at the mall. But that is where I got my fucking cool-ass banana shirt, so Target's an A-plus in my mind. Also, can we just double back for a second? Katie, how the fuck do I radiate grandpa energy? Does it sound like I hate women and minorities? Don't answer that question. <laughs> Don't answer that question. <laughs> does, it, does it always sound like I'm complaining about my fucking... My body and my aches? I never complain. I fucking hate complaining. People who complain are fucking terrible. You know how? What do you mean? What the fuck do you mean by that? You're not General White. At least I don't think so. I watched so many trailers, but can't tell you a thing about the game. He said, "Don't answer that." Hmm. Hello, Fig Newton time. You guys don't know Fig Newton in. Is it's a fucking cookie with a fig in it? You love to see it. Um, the fucking good as fuck. Fig you, baby. How's the progress on the word search? I don't know where my word search book is. What the fuck? How did I lose that thing? I don't know where my word search is. This is a bigger fucking meltdown than I thought it was. Did I leave my word search? This is a fucking problem. I don't know what my word search is. God fucking damn it. I bought a word search while I was at the beach last month and I got through half of it and now it's gone. It was right here. It was directly here. It's fucking gone now. I'm never gonna find it. What the fuck? I don't even I don't even have any idea where it could be. I have no idea. I'm kind of pissed off now. Cuz I fucking lost the only joy in life that isn't Katie. I have to specify that. Word searches. God fucking damn it. They had like every 13 word, a 13th word search. It was a fucking like number search and I hated doing them, but it was the fucking thrill of it. And I don't know where it is now. It's a terrible, it's fucking terrible. I had a special pen I used. It's this pen right here. It's this pen, the special V7 pen. The, the reason it's special is because normally I use, this is also a V7 pen. I use, a V5 pen. The difference between these two is that, first off, V5s and V7s are really good pens. If you don't know, um, it's Precise V5. It's the pilot pen. It's my favorite pen of all time. I know it sounds fucking dorky as fuck to talk about pens. And how, you know, which one you do. But because I was writing so often, you have to have a fucking special pen. And I, this, this is all I use to write now. So, the difference between the two is that this one, this is the V5, the V5, it's, it's, it's extra fine, so it's better for writing, but this one's a V7, and this one is not as fine, but still fine, uh, mm. but it is not as good for writing, it's better for word searches, because it is thicker. This, this, this is, if you're gonna do re word searches, use this pen. If you're not going to use word searches, use this pen. V5, everything else. V7, word search. Okay, it's as simple as that. Crashes tent, fucking pen tips and fig tips. Oh, no. Eat them. Did you look under your bed or in your car or something? Why would I bring my fucking word search in my car? I'm too, too busy with my dick in my hand while I'm at this red lights. This is ridiculous.
What the fuck? That's actually fucking hilarious that you say, Oh, I got you. I got you colored pens. They're not colored. Oh my god. Now I'm pissed off. Now I gotta fucking find this word search. I'm too busy with my dick in my hands. Do you like fucking masturbate? Uh, first off, uh, what kind of word sentence is that? And the answer is 100% gross. Ew. Yes, gross. That's disgusting, gross. Yes, yes. It's fucking disgusting. It's fucking disgusting, and I would never do anything of the sorts. Never. But... But, it's gross. Are we gonna play fucking Paper Mario? What the fuck? What, how did this, how did it fucking go from I'm gonna eat a Fig Newton to me yelling about word searches to now do I like to masturbate? What the fuck? How does that, how the fuck does that connect? You guys are fucking crazy. The night air is getting to your brain. Look, no, I think it was the eight and a half hour shift I worked today and cutting, cutting honeydews. That's what it was. And what was it you said about porn and your little wiener? What the fuck did you talk about my little wiener? God damn it, how do you know how small it is? Where is this fucking bomb? You should seriously do mukbangs. Bro should stand up. Guys, that's the best part. The mukbang happens every stream. I just fucking eat. I should do stand-up. No, the problem is if I do stand-up, I'd be like, um, what's the problem with airplane food? And then I get booed, and then I have to, then I'd cry on stage. My manly tears. A makeup tutorial? Dude, I'd look fucking sick as fuck. You said that you like to watch porn and chick your little guy or something like that. I don't, I don't remember that. Hey, does it now, but sits down? It's true. What's up, Ant? I work with this guy. How's it going, Ant? It was a bad time to come in on a conversation where I'm talking about word searches and shaking my dick. I think that's a real problem. Where the fuck is this bomb guy? Jesus Christ. Okay, let's go back to the far outpost. He could probably give us some information. That was only like three days ago. I need clips. Go, go back to that stream and tell me word for uh, clip it and I'll, i will watch it maybe he's in chapter five chapter five was the what was chapter five the spooky place no that was chapter four chapter five was the island he's not on the island he wasn't he's not on the island because we would have seen him on the island you're thinking of the big how the fuck he hit me? The big purple ba bomb. They're different people. Or at least I'm a hundred percent sure. Get fucked. Yeah, but I'm pretty sure, and by pretty sure, I'm a hundred percent sure that's not him. The island has a Babam crew, so it no he has it's 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 one Babam and it's the purple Babam that's a pirate. That he is not general, right? White. Also, you didn't find him Koopa so it's the island. It's not the island. It's it's not the island. Fupa Town. That's that's where I live on a daily basis. Uh, okay, well, then check the island and prove me wrong. How about I check everywhere that isn't the island and prove you wrong? Cool, I got one point. That's a uh, life shroom. What? The fuck? I definitely got something out of that. It was 2242. 2242 minus 4347. That... One number matches up. 
One number map. <sighs> what the fuck? It's more than I should get more than a constellation prize. Or does it only cancel out? Kiss is down here. It needs to match starting from the last digit. Oh. Also, Raccoon's beat in this game. He's provided me more information than Kissa has just because he's been here. Oh, fuck! Um, I am at the very end of the game, actually. I'm There's eight chapters of the game. I'm on chapter seven, and then we're going to do all the side stuff before chapter eight. Right now, my stats are uh, 30 health, 30 FP, and 30 BP, which is the bad stuff. Uh, and I do... My badges that I have equipped have me doing, like, five damage a jump or something. So I'm doing pretty fucking good. Sasuke, I think um, if you don't watch the entire game here, you should you should play the game yourself. Oh, fire! Yeah. See, the problem is, is that the people who have played this game think my strategy is wrong, and it's that I am a, I'm a menace, and should, you know, not have this kind of stats, and I should probably have better health and stuff. And you know what I said to that? Tisk, tisk, tisk. Fuck you and your health. Who needs health in a day where all you need to do is fucking kill your enemy? Ah, my head, it itches. Email. There's so many emails. Let's go look at my emails. I haven't fucking looked at these in so long. Um... What? What the fuck? Rockhawk, I- No one gives a shit! What? Every time you level up and pick some other shit. Well, no, I have leveled up my health, like, four times. The difference is, is that, you know, I'd rather have more power, uh, power ability. So you have per got permission of gold, Bob, da? Well, now what, uh, what do we need, General Wright? I heard he's seen in Petalburg, you heard there. I was right. He was in Petalburg, I just needed to talk around. HP is 15 opponents are doing 20 a hit, but he picks more of the FP, MP, whatever, John. FP is flower points, which means I can do special moves. BP. BP is badge points, which allow me to put on different badges, which then allow me to um, do sit certain moves or have better things. Here for a good time, not a long time. I respect. Exactly. And I'm going to fucking clown on all these bitches. Starting off with these guys. I don't know how much Stampede does. I'd hope a lot. <gasps> Full blown Yoshis! That did six damage. That's not too bad, but I could just. Oh, it only uses six BP, which makes sense because it is. It is slightly worse. But. Good. BP is blood pressure? Bro, if that was the case, I'd have the highest fucking BP. I could put so many badges on. Got so much blood pressure. Oh, that's me pressuring my pressurizing my blood. Pick your poison mukbang or I mean I'm I'm already doing kind of a mukbang. You just a mukbang is simply eating and talking. I don't think it's much past that, so I guess I literally have to do it. Plus, we can watch people eat gross things on mukbang. Like I, I saw this woman. Fucking have a bucket of live octopuses. This is on YouTube. You can probably find it. And she fucking kills them on camera and cooks them. She cooks some of them live and kills some of them. I, it's crazy. I've heard about that. Yeah. Get him, Gonzalez! Damn, fucking six damage ain't too bad. Ooh, ooh shit. 
My defense is like really good right now. This is the best community I've ever been a part of. LGBTQ plus sucks. What the fuck? That's not even funny. I know you said JK, but that's not super. I'm not super fan. Luma speed. That wasn't. I'm sorry. That wasn't funny. I'm sorry, but I'm going to rescind the joke for you. LBBTQ, not LGBTQ. But that's what he meant. Because then he said I was not a part of the gay community. So, soup fan, shut the fuck up. I was right. Plus, what the fuck? I feel like we all forget that I have, like, so much fucking power here. Like, I literally own the power. I'm a power-hungry god. You're gonna drop a hard R here in a minute? Well then, get ready for a fucking meanest a hunt a one million second timeout. I don't want to ban you, but that's the, I have to give you the most severe punishment equivalent if you do that. That, that, I mean, that is the rules. Illuminati. Bro, there ain't no Illuminati about it. You have to defeat me. It's the only way. Bro, it's pretty easy. I, I did that all the time. I'd fucking pick you up and almost throw you into the road. That was the joke. Fuck yeah, water's so good. Twice a shift I get chucked into the highway? Yeah, exactly. So, you're telling me, Mario, how is my boy Koops doing? If he's not pulling his way, just let me know. I'll take his place in a group like that. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'd, I'd resemble Jazz from The Fresh Prince. <laughs> yeah. Commander White? This is Petalburg, right? I'm, I am in Petalburg. Hey, Mario! You're Luigi's older brother, right? That's so cool. I mean, you're cool too, and all, but I just think that Luigi is the greatest. Thanks. And fuck you? I don't imagine he's in the pink house, but we're going to look anyways. Oh, I'm innocent, Murphy. Oh, what do you want? What do you want? General White is hiding. Hmm, General. Hmm, I will well, certainly have seen him around, but not lately, no. I think he may have possibly said he was headed south to a more tropical locale. Are you fucking kidding me? Creaky key. How the fuck is he on the island? What the fuck? He literally isn't on the island. That's not the right reason. What the fuck? He he fucking wasn't on the island. Now he's on the island. He wasn't on the island until he spoke to the mayor. Raccoon, thank you for backing me up. This motherfucker better not be here. He better be- Yeah, I decided to go up north to fucking Treehouse Town. Where the fuck is he? You, where is he? Mm, General idea, he was here just a second ago, uh, but he took off right quick. Uh, he said he's going to arena. Go fuck yourself, soup fan. I was right. Now we're going to Arena Town. Can is there a way to teleport there easily? Oh, no, do I have to leave the fucking sewer to go to the fucking 
plane? I guess so. I guess so. Which sucks. I'm high energy today. All my energy is gone into now because I've just been fucking working. Nah, he was on the island. He wasn't on the island. He was there, but that's not where we found him. Or will find him. And he was... If you are literally saying... You are saying that he was on the island. He was in Petalburg as well. So he was in Petalburg. You are actually just wrong with what you're saying. I'm not even... He's just going to hurt himself. I didn't mean to do that. There's so many... Why do they have so many rocks? But he was on the island and only left a few seconds ago. Yeah, and he spent the entire game on Petalburg. And your... And your point is... He's not there now. So you're fucking... Wrong. Ha <laughs> ha. <laughs> Dude, I have... There's a oh fuck! I looked away for one second at my fucking fig newtons to see how many fig newtons we have, which is a lot. We have a lot of fig newtons. Well, I wouldn't say a lot, but still, I could have gotten murderlated right there. Murderlated. All right, on to the plimp. Plimp. Blimp or plimp? I like plimp more. I know it's not right, but plimp. Man. Can we talk for a second about how his blimp is his face? Like, yeah, I get it, it's a fish, it's a, you know, it's a cheap cheap. But the, but the blimp and the, the conductor, if you were, were the same thing. Blimp sounds like another word for tripping. I don't really see it, but, okay. Sure. Oh, sorry about your luck, buddy. Ha, lower you, just got blimped. I think you meant loser. I'm not talking to this fucking living pineapple. I gotta find the gal. I don't think appearance of cheap cheeps can vary as much as they do in humans. Okay, and it sounds... And what I said is wrong. No, it's not. It's still the same person. Supan, I feel like... You o your only thing... Is to just try to d d d disagree with me. Yes, yes, who is it? Uh, it's Cusper and knock before entering. Oh, why? It's the Great Gonzalez. It's been too long. How have you been? I must tell you, we've seen a drop-off in attendance since you returned the belt. I was a touch worried. Our financials didn't look too good for a while, but... Luckily, Rockhawk made a dramatic comeback and is reigning supreme again. Yes, it's been a whirlwind of activity every day since I became a promoter. Wait, just a moment. Are you back to fight? G Great Gazala's return. You must be right. Yes, you must be. Come on, tell me it's true. What? You want to unretire and battle again? Ha <laughs> ha, I always knew this day would come. Let me just find your old registration so we can, uh... Oh, oof, I'm so sorry, but all the records you seem to be... Uh, you seem to be gone. So our only option, sadly, is to start you in the minor league again. Uh, even though we definitely won. Sorry, but rules are rules. We can't bend them even for the uh, an ex-champ. Ex-champ? I still am the champ! I'll just go ahead and put you on as the minor league fighter again, then. When you want to fight, you just know the deal. Use the locker room communicator. I will not be going over the arena rules again, of course. Bye for now. Okay, that was not helpful. If I see a thousand door, at least... A 
the th thrifty door. I am so getting it. This is a good fucking game. I bought it off of eBay for like 20 or 30 bucks or something. But this hasn't helped. Who do I talk here for? For Commander White. Maybe in the juice bar. Welcome back, Gonzales. Everyone's been a Twitter waiting for your return. We've all missed your fabulous moves. The fuck? General White, oh, you must have been that white pop huh? Well, he used to come here all the time. I haven't seen him lately. And I think about it, I think he headed off to some huge tree. It's also the 1,000-year door, not the 100-year door. My parents spent, I found I spent $115 on soundtrack, maybe I won't be getting anything on eBay anytime soon. To be fair, that was your own fault. Maybe you should have spent $115 on soundtracks. You space it out a little bit more. Bum 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 I stole my parents So they forbid me from buying things yes. That's gonna eat down by the way so I think I'm, it was worth it five hours of running time. Five hours for a hundred and fifteen dollars Yet I play this $30 game for me, and it's been 24 I pay $5 for Cookie Clicker, and I have 150 hours into that game. And still counting. Um. I gotta head down here. With Super Mario soundtrack, and it would be about a hundred dollars. Still, a hundred bucks for a soundtrack. I'm not a soundtrack guy. I, I'm not a soundtrack guy. I steal from my parents all the time. That's how I purchased Mario 3D All Stars. Yeah, but that's not a thing you should celebrate. Stealing is still stealing, and that is not a tolerated thing. Yeah, that's... This is no... Uh, the game is even... Listen, soup fan, no matter what, you will never justify it in anybody of, in anyone's eyes that that is okay. That is not okay. You do not steal. No matter who's it from, you don't fucking steal. I mean, that's just a fact. I mean, really take a second and think about it. How would you feel if someone fucking took $60 from you without asking? 60 hard-earned dollars. For me, that's fucking five hours of work. Stealing a virginity is a rape. If you're giving your virginity away, it is not rape. But stealing it is rape. That's what that is. Quite literally. What do you mean, what about it? What the fuck? Ah, when did my chat become hooligans that do the devious lick TikToks? Which at first I thought was hilarious, but now it's becoming a fucking criminal issue, which is a kind of a problem. Huh. 
<sighs> Hold on, cowboy boot. Let me get into the next fucking pipe. Okay. Bro, if he can scream that I can be annoying in the chat. If he can scream that, then I can be annoying in the chat. What do you mean if I could scream? I haven't been screaming yet. This is just me l l loving my voice and making it louder. Alright, get that pipe. I don't know what you guys mean about screaming. I don't scream. I project my voice forward. See, I could talk like this. Or I could talk like this. It's the exact same, but my voice is slightly louder. I'm projecting. And then when I stop projecting, I do this. I, I am no longer projecting. But now I am projecting. See? That's the difference. That is the difference. Mansplaining? The fuck? My balls haven't even dropped yet. The fuck you mean? I ain't a man yet. How would you read my elegy? I don't know. My Eugene, I can't spell it. Eugene. At Super Mario 3D All Stars is one years old. No, it's not. It's not one years old. March 31st, Mario died. It's not been a year. No, no, it's... Liter no, it's not. It literally isn't. Mario died. March 31st. No, wait, Mario died... March 31st, the game stopped, right, so, no, I, you were right, you were right, I had, I had the date in mind, it was the opposite end where he died, no, you're right, no, you're right, I accept my defeat, Mario died that day, ow, fuck, <sighs> that was April 1st, that was April 1st, wasn't it, no, no, that game got, like, the game was never sold again, technically. I say technically because you can still find it, like, everywhere. But the game was to stop, actually stop being sold and they weren't joking about it. Which was sad. Excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. Now, please don't fuck this jump up this time. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. How was, um... Your guys' day, you guys don't... I asked that question, I feel like you guys don't answer. Some of you did earlier when I asked. But then new people have come in the chat. What did Sasuke say to Cowboy Boot when she overcooked the roast? Kapow! Did she- did he say that or act upon it? I slept all day- well, Katie, I know that, silly. Ah, uh, hey, it's the savior of our town, it's Mario, ever since that pig business were a constant guard. Sleep sucks? What? N you love sleep! No, never mind. I was wrong. You hate sleep. Right, you're the opposite of Katie in that way. But Katie slept all day. I would know she woke up as I got to work, and then she took a nap four hours after that and didn't wake up until I got home. So she's been awake for four hours of the day.
What the fuck? Well, you're not helpful. I thought you would know about General White. He's not here. He's probably went home. Wait, what did he say? Yeah, he's probably okay, he's probably home now. In Pedalburg, by the way, not on the island. Yeah, that's what I assume too. He doesn't live on the island. He visited the island. Oh, went, oh, went back to, oh. Went back to Far Outpost, you mean. Oh, shit! Okay. <laughs> Fuck me! I really felt like that hammer should have hit me, but it didn't. Ow, fuck, I hit my heel on my chair. You can change. He's just like every other nine-year-old, though. I did cringy shit when I was when I was nine, and I'm sure everyone else here, when they were nine year old, did a cringy fucking shit. That's like what it means to be nine years old. Um. All right, we'll just do this. damage do I defend now? It looks like I just fucking am able to defend five damage. When you were nine, you worked you worked uphills both ways. Man. Why can't I live in Kansas? Apparently it's flatter than a Flatter than a fucking pancake. Ah, the the four fucking things of war. Why did you go and find General White? Hmm. The mustache gentleman. Where has he gone to? Now where did he go? Ah, uh, this is not his voice. This makes trouble for us. We definitely need him. Otherwise, we cannot even operate that thing. So what to do? You should know the pain of both these levels and run our Odyssey and the Gauntlet. Let's try that one more time. I got it.
Look, man, my man's just sleeping. <laughs> it could be more asleep. I like how it's fucking different things every time. That's fucking hilarious. Ugh. No, who are you? I am tired and I do not need your attention. But to sleep is it, uh, as it is all hopeless. Hut, that mustache, that hat, and that hammer even. Hut, hut, I have been looking for everywhere for you. Why, well, to bring that cannon back online, I have lost my life's work, my reason to live. I found myself at wit's end, and then Rogueport fortune teller told me, seek the man with the M hat, the one with the hammer and the stash. He will fulfill your dreams, or, or something like that. But you need to use the cannon to save the entire world. Hope, hip, hooray that fortune teller was right. So what are you waiting for? I shall get the cannon ready, so go tell the mayor. Now get moving, hot, hot. Okay. So Ganon is back online. Well, I could just explode with delight. Now let's let's shoot you guys to the moon. We've done it, old boy. Now you follow me. You come this way. Mario, really? You're not going to actually follow him? Jeez. Jeez. Ooh. Preparations are complete. The cannon is ready to fire. Why am I doing his voice? Hut, let's do this. Now you stand here. General White, is Big Bomb Cannon ready? Hot, leave it to me! Now, men, you know the drill, load the Big Bomb Cannon! Ho, hot, hot, ho, boom! Now, positions, everyone! Yes, sir! Oh, my God. Bring guidance system online. Bringing. Bringing system online. System now online. System check. System check all clear. Preparation for. Preparation for donation sequence. Donation. Open outer hatch. Oh my god. Oh my god. Open in a shutter. Elevate on my mark. Well, it's a big cannon. Sighting target is the moon. Direction seventy five point three eight, elevation fifty four sixty six, range three three eight nine six oh three, sir. Wind speed one oh eight. Do correction, dire correction, correct direction, 3.03. .03. Correct elevation, negative 2.39. Target locked, chamber hacked, ch fuck. Chamber hatch opened. Now, everyone in.
They should have hid one pink bob bomb in there. For Bobbin. Close chamber hatch! It's crowded in here, Boom. Stop pushing, Kabazumi! Ow, wow, wow, you're on my foot, Kaboom! It's tight in here, Bloom! Conditions all green. Stand by, okay? It is time! Big Bomb Cannon! Fire! Yahoo! Yeah, 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 yeah! That was so awesome! Good luck, Mario! Ant. Yeah! I will give you your, your snack in one minute. Hold on, I gotta, we gotta get through this cutscene first. I can't pause it, so... Harumph, well, that was rather a bumpy trip, what was? Who would have guessed it I'd do such a thing? Well, old boy, we're really on the moon by Crabbery. So what you say, shall we find the last crystal star and save Peach? Hmm? Oh, yeah. Thank you. All right. The moon. And first, it is snack time. That is the wrong direction. No, wrong. This way. I somehow... F man somehow forgets the direction of his own hair. Fig Newton. No. Oh. Mm. Fuck him. Neat. I fucking love Fig Newton. It's so good. You know what? In celebration of Ant using his first channel points, I'm eating a second one. So I'm to put my hair up. I did the beginning of the stream, and now we're gonna do it again. Because the hair is annoying me now. It was something annoys me. I take care of it. Immediately. Kind of. That's wrong. That's actually wrong. I'm too lazy to do it immediately. Another nightly snack? What the fuck? What do I look like? A fucking pig? Oink, oink, fat fuck. Eat for our amusement. I will. I, I mean, I will. But... You know, that is wrong. There we go. Man, that thing really dangles. Look at fucking how much hair I got there. Dude. I like, like one of the fucking Koopa kids right now. <laughs> what, like Lenny, I think his name is. I'm fucking hopping up on a ball. I like it when it's a little bit more down. But, you know. Yeah, okay, I get the side view. It's a girl from fucking in the night garden. Who's fucking in the night garden? Who's fucking in a garden? Why would you ever fuck in the garden? Fuck, that's how you get thorns in your dick. You know? God, fig news are so good. They're so good. If you've never had a fi if you've never had a fig newton eat them. They're so good. Or mid tier, yeah, I mean. I'll give you that. But fig fig newtons are good. God damn it. Eat fig newton. Or this will happen. Eat fig newton or this. I don't know why this is funny to me. I know I'm not laughing, but internally I am having a bat blast. Look how shiny my finger is. 
<laughs> Eat fucking Fig Newton now! Never heard of Fig Newton until yesterday. I don't, well. You better fucking eat Fig Newton now, or else. God damn it. It looks like I'm actually just trying to point you. I'm just trying to fucking. I'm just trying to. F <laughs> Wearing 3D glasses. Oh my god. It's right in my face. Holy fuck. Guys, he's trying to actually poke me. <laughs> I don't know. That's so fucking funny. This is every early two this is every 2000s movie that had 3D in it. Hey, you! <laughs> that shit fucking is hilarious to me. I got to stop watch. Oh my god. This is the slowest fucking thing ever. Imagine watching me in VR. <laughs> that's a that's a fucking disaster waiting to happen. Why did I break that rock up? There's gotta be like a reason. I guess not. No, wait, I wanted Yoshi. This is like mandatory at this point. I, I, you know, I'm happy that you guys enjoy the eating and drinking bit. I, that is one of my favorite. Oh fuck, it's a rock boy! He's made out of rocks! But I, I do, I am happy that you guys like that bit. It is one of my favorite bits to do. All right, quick, tell me what their fucking postal code is. Mooncleft. He is five? Holy shit! Five? Defense? That's fucking crazy! You could also bet I have no... anything. Lamont, we enjoy it. It, it does it does make me very happy to know that you guys enjoy me eating okay you know there's no need to just kill her okay <laughs> never mind I guess oh god you guys you fucked up you messed with the wrong guy Equip badges that give you stronger attacks, maybe? Are you fucking dumb? I do that anyways. This is the strongest I've ever been and will ever be. Well, to, I guess to be fair, you haven't been through the other streams, so I take back, are you fucking dumb? Stole my other friend's glass case and tried to get the courage to get to his get out his pinky inside and slam the lid down. I put my pinky in. It was only the tip. That's how I managed. Made the mistake of saying no out it deeper. What the fuck are you trying to say? They only give me like three BP. I need two uh, star points per thing. We use Mrs. Mia to farm power plus badges on the fire. Wait a minute. You're right. Power plus badges. That sounds like a fucking amazing thing. The problem is, is that farming sucks. I got a shell. I no longer have the shell. Hopefully there's no new enemies up here. Fuck, I need BP! Nah, we're fine. 
How did that do damage? Oh, uh, I guess it probably cuts through defenses. Probably, if I had to guess. Probably a good guess. Alright, here we are again. Fuck me! Not gonna do enough damage to kill them. One of them, though. Not until I use Earthquake and destroy both of them. That, well, why was that? Why'd you do that? Ooh, rock. No! Oh. Did I get the ground pound in? Will it count as the ground pound? It doesn't. didn't count as the ground pound. I was sad. Um. Earth Tremor! Guess we're using this again. I mean, I guess so. I'm cool with it, though. Nice. I am... Seven away, so that's like three of that enemy still. fuck did I not blow this up? Ruin badge. I like the name. I don't need this card shell. No! Okay. What do gold bars do? They, they hold my money. That is what they do. Quite literally. Ah! That could have been useful. But alas, we just go through it the old, all the old-fashioned way, just fucking fighting him like a normal person. And then it'll be one experience point away from leveling up. Oh. Good job, Bobbery. Nice job. Alright, so now... We literally only need one thing left. And then I'll probably upgrade health next, honestly. I don't see why I wouldn't. Why am I going all the way to the left? Oh fuck, new enemy. He definitely has more than 12 HP. Or 10 HP, right? Oh, no, he doesn't. Wow, that is... That's a problem for him. Nice. And we leveled up. Which we love to see. Well, a million U.S. dollars is great. I mean, don't get me wrong. But I'm pretty sure a thousand gold bars is more. How much is gold right now? That I don't know off the top of my head. 
Oh, Goombella's still dead? I don't have any way to bring her back. Well, didn't know she was still dead, to be fair. What's this move? Oh, fuck. I have to use my big brain because these are not the, the... The the buttons that are on my controller. I really have... When I do that, I really have to, like, just fucking put my mind into... To mental mode. Because that shit is hard. That is a hard for me. But also, really easy at just fucking... I don't want to fight you. <laughs> it's like a free death, basically. Uh, that... That... Fuck, okay. Eh, 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 eh. Eh, 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 eh. Okay. Eh, 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 eh. Okay, perfect. Just curious, how come you also refer to me Luma Speed? Because we uh, we've known you as Luma Speed, and you still, you know, and you you still you know respond to Luma Speed. So I think that's fair. We had a life up thing right now because that'd be useful. Also, there is a thing right there. Oh my god, he's dead. Kind of can't do anything with Bobbery here. He's also going to summon somebody, so it's... All right, well, I'm fucking, all right. Sure, we'll just, this fight seems fine with me. I guess I'll switch characters. Um, who would be good here? Probably Brett. I, d I didn't have anything to say about that fight, honestly. I just wish Gumbella was still alive so I could... You know... Tattle on them. I don't have any way to get her alive now. Just sad. I thought the level up would save her, but I guess not. Oh, it would have if I had her out, I think. Now that I think about it. That probably is the case. There is nothing over here, is there? Nope. Why would you let me come over here, then? <sighs> Rather suspicious building, wouldn't you say, old boy? Do be careful, eh? Shut the fuck up.
Luma Speed. I'm not Luma Speed. Goombella. Damn. Who is that dude? Whoa! That's Mario! Uh, so let's get him? Oh, I don't wanna. Ah, uh, can this bring people back to life? Two enemies you'll never tap. I mean, I'm gonna tap. I'm gonna heal, and then I mean, there's more of these guys. I'm like sure of it. Yay! Yab. Oh, well, that. Come on. I feel like the game did that just to spite me. Bye, losers. Yeah. Mario, if these X not dweebs are here, that's totally it. Then we quit. Then the Crystal Star is supposed to be here too, don't you think? And Peach must be here too. We gotta find her. It's not gonna use on the final boss. It's not gonna work. I'm not gonna waste my star points. All right. See, now we're gonna go back. And we'll title those guys. It's the one thing that I have completion-wise that I want to do now. Uh. Now I just gotta find one. Oh, there he is. Oh, right, he has a projectile. Get him! Oh, seven, seven health? Good to know. Well, if it was just those two guys, then I can go to Professor Goompis, or whatever his name is, and their tattle would just be in the bucket, so I wouldn't need to tattle them. <clears throat> because then it would count as a mini-boss. And you would never be able to fight him again. But, because I've tattled every boss I can... That's not a problem. And mini boss. <clears throat> but they're just regular enemies. Thank God for tab. Gotta love the button tab to do this. <clears throat> Alright. Let us save. All right. Fucking jamming out here. Oh look, it's the same enemy. Okay, he has at least 15 health. At the most, 15. Okay, 10 health. Well, that's good. Mm. That does 16 damage normally, because he had one defense. 16 damage is pretty fucking good, actually. I need to sell these gold bars. Okay, I was on the right track, apparently. 
Oh, I guess, I guess it's one more over then. Up, up, right. Nope. One more up. Okay, see? I got it. First try. I do like the music of this area. Quite a bit. Hopefully there- I don't imagine so, but hopefully there's a shop in here. <laughs> I've already fought an next time. This hopefully isn't a different... Nope, we've already fought this guy, okay. Good, 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 good. Nice. Doo -doo -doo. Ooh, already halfway to the next level up again? Wow. I'm surprised Miss Kiss isn't here yet. Honestly. Ooh. Gears under repair. I'll fix it. Oh, shit. There's two badges up there? I like badges. Quick! Mario! Fix it! I don't think he fixed it. Sadly, I don't think he fixed it. Are you going till three? Yeah, that's probably the plan. <clears throat> and the only reason I don't sound certain about that is I technically still need to wake up at 7.30 tomorrow to go take my dogs out, but then I can go back to sleep, so I don't really, I don't really care. You know, I can at least, <clears throat> you know, I can wake up for that. Do that, go back to sleep. And, um, sleep for a little bit longer. Sort of thing. <clears throat> I'd like to at least beat this chapter. Today. You're an animal. Look, man. I don't know what you mean. You're an animal? Holy shit, he's a scientist. Nerd! Did you know there's a second action command for this? Did you know that there is an action command for the second bounce of the jump moves? What do you... What do you mean? I need answers. What do you mean by that? Nine fucking dead. Holy shit. Zan, Sony didn't get to hear before, but how come you still refer to me as Luma Speed? Are you fucking kidding me, really? Uh, I We refer to you as Luma Speed because that's what you came in on the stream was as, and that's, you know, what we how it stuck. Plus, you still respond to it, so it, you know, it works. Also, Luma Speed rolls off the, the tongue more. Commander video does not. Mr. Commander. Dude, you have come in your name. I don't I don't say come. Never say come. But Luma Speed. Oh yeah, it has peed in his name. That's perfect. I'm a child, ladies and gentlemen. I don't know if we knew this. Oh, I didn't know that did. You didn't drink that, you just... You know, don't, don't ask. Do you know how come is spelt? Well, I know how to spell things better than you, apparently. Jesus Christ. L Lumis, you gotta spell check your fucking shit before you send it my way. This is like the 80th message that had something... Misspelled. 
And you're coming at me for spelling? Okay. Mario was protected. You'll love to see it. Nice. Oh, it's not going to let me do the potion thing? Why are all the notes different now? Who's... What was Princess Peach reading? You like Luma Speed better anyways? Yeah, why did you change your name? Okay, apparently one more over. Ow. Gotta go to bed, it's 10, 12. Well, have a great night, man. It's always lovely having you. And I'll see you tomorrow when we start Luigi's Mansion 3. I hope everyone's there tomorrow. Uh, because Luigi's Mansion 3 is going to be, you know, a game that I've never played. And we're going to be playing it together. So I'm really excited for that. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, fuck. Okay, we're good. But, yeah, hopefully I... Well, I'll, I'll see you tomorrow. Oh, man. It's going to be a new game tomorrow. Holy shit. That's exciting. A game I've never played or seen. I have... I've... Vowed not to look at this game. All I know is that it's in a hotel and you collect... Hotel... Elevator buttons. Before I go crash, I want to send you a pictures of a cute dog. You already sent me pictures of your dog, though. I mean, you're welcome to do it again. I just... You, you already have done that. Maybe we should just start pressing buttons and letting it teleport me somewhere. Um, where are we? It's so much hassle putting it up on stream. <laughs> it really is. We're beneath Rollport. The Xbox used that thing to come here from the moon. It takes me like 10 minutes. I look at your dog, though. Oh, shit. Let me sell the gold bars before I'm a fucking stupid head. Wrong place. I don't know why I always think it's that place. But have a great night, Luma Speed, and I'll see you tomorrow. No. What's my points looking like? Seven points. I forget what the points do. To be honest with you. I do forget what the points do. Toad in the shop is cute. Why don't you marry her? Sorry, that was uncalled for. Okay, I need to get up there via some... Paper manipulation. Ow. Nice. Uh, 
Um, I mean, honestly, Goombella is just the best one to have here. You forgive me? Thank you. I appreciate that. Wait a minute. I have to look at something. See? I almost fucked up. Didn't even think about doing that. Now I'm trying to think, did I do that with the other one? Because that I don't know. Yeah. I think I did. Pretty sure. Damn, how many fucking rooms are here? Shit. Ooh, changing room. Left, right, middle. Zero, fourteen, twenty-nine. Okay. Zero, fourteen, twenty-nine. Or zero, four, fourteen, zero, twenty-nine. Fourteen, twenty-nine. It's kind of all I need to remember. Ten health. Wow. Oh, wow. Summons two. Could be dangerous. Even though it's, I mean, shouldn't be a problem. I don't see why it, it would be a problem. Alright. Cool, 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 cool. He's now gonna summon two. And then I'll switch to Mario, do the multi-bounds again. Bump, bump, bump. And then just fucking... Perfect. Fucking perfect. There's probably a star piece in this room. You know what? There probably is a star piece in this room as well. Mmm, no, wow. That's a surprise. Really? Not in this room either? Holy shit! Hold on, now I'm worried, because now I have to look back. Not a badges. Wow, we have almost all the badges. Um, where is they? Yes, yucks, mini yucks, mini z yucks. Exit. Okay, yes, we got them. Good. Good, 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 good. Well done. Well done. Oh, fuck. <laughs> I don't want to fight these enemies. But if I must. 
Uh, showstopper. Apparently, I'm pretty decent at this, so. As he almost fucks it up. It does give you... Oh, fuck. It does give you a lot of time. Oh, shit. That's okay, though. Fuck! Damn it! This was not... I didn't mean to do that. Like, I still take it. I just didn't mean to. I mean, yeah, it's, it's totally cool. Like, I'll take the additional stuff. I just, like I said, I didn't mean to do it. Also, I'm super close to leveling up. I think I'm three... No, no, I haven't. Wow. Nice. Nice! Alright, FP it is again. I hope chapter two has Jevil in a wheelchair. Oh, you're talking about Delta Rune. Should have said that. Um, yeah, I probably won't play it. I, I own Undertale and I've never even beaten that. Like, I know the game, I just haven't beaten it. Um... What was he gonna say? I don't remember. Oh, shit. Um... Showstopper! <laughs> it's like, I don't want to use the... the my FP for this, but I don't mind using star power, I guess. Uh, 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 uh. Ah, fuck! Yo! Yeah! You love to see that. You love to see it. Can't do anything? Oh, I can do something to the right. Okay. What about to the left? There is something left. This is the cog. Oh my god, there's more than I thought. And a star piece. This is the cog room. No, but it does get me up here, which is interesting. I didn't know it would let me up there. Now I walk back. Uh, can I go to any other area? Oh, I can't. Okay, I can go to sub one, but that doesn't matter to me right now. Have I been in this room? Yes, this is the teleporter room. So the room right next to the last one is that. Okay. Then the next room is... What is this room? This room is the room I was in. Okay. And the one all the way to the right, I think, is the changing room. I mean, we'll look really quick, but I think that's what it is. Alright, up we go. And like I said, we're going to go look real quick before I go up. Simply because I want to make sure I'm thorough. And then we'll go up, put the cog in, and then it's left, right, middle. I believe that's what it was referring to, at least. I hope. Okay, that was right. <gasps> Holy shit! I didn't know- Oh, that's so cool. She has booba. 
My grandmother texted me out of the blue and asked me why I was up. After you responded. Why is she up? This is so cool. I didn't... I forgot about this. That's neat. What key did I get then? I got a key from Balthazar's room. Key that opens a door in the... Oh, well that doesn't really help now, does it? From fucking Balthazar's room. What's his name again? Fucking... Zoinks. I don't remember. But what, was she just asking how your day was? Or some shit? It's a little odd to text, for your grandmother to text you all late like that, but then again... I don't know. Maybe she cares about you deeply. I care about you deeply, Katie. I know I care. She like how's college? For some reason, I wrote that. As, I read that as collage. I was a little disappointed in myself. I could I could have not said that out loud, but I thought you guys should know. Oh shit. What a mini game this is. Truly, what a what a what a mini game. But how is college? <laughs> Supin, you always say that, but what if you're not going to college? I assume you're going to a trade school, which is college. Um what, what do you plan on doing with your life, then? What, 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 what occupation do you want? Wow. This fucking crane game is better than most fucking crane machines in real life. Whatever job you can find. Okay. And you're gonna do that forever? And let me, let me, let me run this, work this, try to work this with you real quick. So let's say you wanna really, you know, you wanna, you wanna build a life. Right? Oh, you want a house. You wanna live on your own. You want a car. They cost money, right? And, you, and most jobs are, what, $12 an hour, $15 an hour, which is what I'm making now. I make maybe $1,000 a month. $12,000 a year. It's going to be pretty hard to do anything. Just saying. Where the fuck do I go? I've already I was already in this room. Unless I can do something with the computer. No. 18th birthday equals move out. But how are you going to move out? You do not have money. And moving out in an apartment requires money. And you have to do everything. 
You could, yeah, you could say you're gonna move out. I said I was gonna move out. But then, you get to this point where you're like, well, I can't move out. I simply do not have money to move out. Because when you move out, let's say you buy an apartment. You have to pay every month for that. Plus, on top of that, you need to pay for food, right? Food, bills, like, you know, cell phone and internet. You also have to pay for gas and a car, inevitably. And you're going to do that all, all of that on a $12,000 salary a year? Pretty hard to do. Pretty impossible. Seriously, where the fuck do I go? <sighs> been in every room here. Have I been in every room upstairs? That's my next guess. Oh, nope. I have to go all the way to the right. That's what I need to do. Soup fan. As I say this every time, you are just like, this is what's going to happen. You're not thinking small. Also, you assumed I was going to a trade school, so I would, ha I would have, I would still have an education, would I not? I assumed you're going to trade school, but here's the thing. Here's the... Th Let's just take a second. You graduate high school at 17 or 18. Right? I graduated when I was... Ow. I graduated when I was 18. Well, 17. Three days. Right? And so... Let's just, like, really take a second and think about this. So, when you're 18, you're going to then move out with the money you have. You could go to a trade school. Yes, that also costs money, by the way. And I'm sure stealing $60 from your parents isn't going to make them want to pay for your trade school. Uh, but, even if they do pay, they're probably not going to pay for everything. So, you'll have to pay for some things. On top of that, you'll need a job for money anyways, because how are you going to get to school? Gas. There's no bus. And I'm sure your parents are going to drive you. Right? So, gas. It's like $30 a week. We graduated the day before. Whatever. Katie, it doesn't matter. It's the same same difference here. Same difference. Either way, you're... You're small-braining it. You gotta look at the bigger picture here. Yeah, you can move out when you're 18, but you will not have nothing else. You will not be able to live. Yeah, you have an apartment, sure. For a month with the piggy bank you've been saving up with. But that's a, probably about it. I, there's no way I could pay off a fucking uh, a fucking apartment right now. I'm, I'm making the most I've ever made. And I work 32 hours. And plus more. I'm making th like 350 a week. And that's a good job. Even if you're like, okay, I'm making $15 a week, which is like more than most people get. You know? Not only getting taxed, by the way. That's... Work the same amount I am. That's what four fifty, four fifty a week. What, what the fuck are you gonna pay four fifty a week? Rent is normally like five hundred, six hundred bucks. Plus, again, if you're gonna move out, it's also more than that. Why did I say five? It's gonna be more than that. Plus food, entertainment. Well, if it goes in this order. Food. Internet, then entertainment, because, let's be real, you need food and you need internet nowadays. Those are mandatory things. On top of that, you need, like, God knows how many more things you're going to need. Furniture, that's that costs stuff. Maintenance. 
to move out when you're 18 is either a really smart move when you are making money by yourself and you're using it to get away from people or a stupid fucking move because you are wasting money on a dumb purchase because you want to move out early. Why not stay home for another year or two? Save up that money. And then when you're in college, like I am right now, I'll be staying here for the next year and a half. You save up the money and get an apartment then. Because moving out, moving out at 18 is, is such a risky and almost impossible move. Yeah, you can move out at when you're 18. But it's so unbelievably hard to do after that. Look at me. I'm literally 18. I've wanted to move out. Have I? Obviously not. Why? Because I like streaming. So I wanted to upgrade this. And if I put money into this, I can't move out. If I wanted gas money, I can't move out. If I wanted food for myself, I can't move out. If I wanted college, I can't move out. I have to pay for $2,400 for my next semester. And that's half of it. I need double that. Wait, like a month after that. Do you think the age of majority should be changed to 19? No. 18's fine. But the problem is, is that it's people like you that's like, I'm going to move out when I'm 18. It's going to happen. And then you're going to get fucking struck with life. And it's going to... I was like this. Maybe not to the same extent. Because I was like, ah, I know money's a problem. Money's going to be very tight. But... And I was, I was, I was already... I wanted to go to college. I was going to fucking work my ass off. But... Like, 18's fine. It makes sense. Because there are people out there that are able to make that switch. And should be able to make that switch. Miss Kissa, what the fuck is up? D don't worry. You've only... You just come in on a conversation of me telling what Soup Fan... Saying uh, he's going to move out at 18 is a terrible idea. And that's basically it. Also, we're on the moon. I... We're on the moon. I didn't mean to use Earth Tremor, but I am here now using Earth Tremor. That's alright, though. I wanted to use Showstopper, but honestly, I'm not too worried about it. Fuck me. I'm not sure this is going to actually do anything. Oh, no, it is. Miss Kissa, I think you would be happy to look at the health, by the way. Besides, I'd, I'd turn 18 a few months before graduate stage. I'd still be in high school the day I move out, which would be my 18th birthday. Look, soup fan. I, in the most kindness that I can say. And the most kindness that I can say. This is another one of your bad ideas. You should really think about money management. It's, um... Fuck. It was zero... Nineteen... Zero twenty-four. Fuck! Yeah, you. you uh. I would be eighteen and still. I've had a job for two years. Two years. I went from making six fifty an hour to nine seventy five an hour, and now twelve an hour.
The problem is, is that you can't just save up money. Because when you have money, you spend it. Because when you have money, then op other opportunities open up. It's impossible to just save up like that. You just go, oh, I'm going to not spend any money, ever. But that's, that's the problem. Money's a curse. You get money, and then you want to spend money. And getting a job is not that easy, I would know. Because I've only had two. And I stayed at one for two years. Because I knew if I left, it would be fucking impossible for me to get another job. The only reason I was able to get this new job was because I said I had working experience for two years and it was a giant supermarket. They're always understaffed. The problem a lot of people have is that ap applications are... Uh, are real, really a big problem. My friend, uh, Teddy, he's been trying to get a job for the past two years. I, he just got a job at the same giant that I'm working at two days ago. And that was because I helped him. It's not just gonna happen. That, you have to make it happen, by the way. And one thing that, that matters is your appearance and personality. Uh, a lot of young teenager jobs are personality-based because you're working with customers, often in a fast food place or a supermarket or something. I deal with customers every day. I, I have to be fucking kind. Which is no problem for me because I'm a nice person. Sometimes. I try to be nice. But... What was that hot for? What the fuck? Either way... You have to be nice. On top of that, you have to look at least presentable. And I don't want to go back to the conversation about your fucking hair shit in your in the fucking hair shampoo shit that's in your hair. That's not a desirable trait. Stupid. I I mean this in the most respectable way possible. I really do. But you have to think before you just say that's going to happen. That's the problem. I think before I say what's going to happen, and I'm still even wrong. That's the best part. Because no matter how much you think that something is just going to happen magically, there's also always another variable. Literally every time. I like that, that. That's all I have to say. I just feel like you're... You're just gonna make it happen. Oh, my oh, Alakazam! Money! I wish I could do that. That's what I'm doing here. Money! That's what fucking. That's what you need to do. Fine, you'll stay with your parents. Okay, good. Now you're gonna save money. Now the question is, what are you gonna do after that? Trade school. But then, what do you want to be? The whole question was originally, what do you want to do? Speaking of saving up, how's that Reading coming along? Yeah, so we, uh, we gotta go back to the thing and we gotta check the code out. Fuck! Wrong way! By the way, Supin, the, the original question was, what do you want to do? <laughs> like, what, what was your career path? You just said any job. But if you're going to a trade school, you need to have a specific trade in mind. It's not like college where you're just like, I don't have a major. Let me get some of my core things out of the way. Trade school is meant for you to learn a trade. So what trade? If you don't know what trade, then you're not going to trade school. Like I said, it's, it's not like college where you just say, fuck it, I'm going to fucking Penis University. I don't know what I want. We'll do core classes. You might qualify for the job corpse. The job corpse? Are you saying that he's going to fucking die? God damn it, I... Uh... 
Does this say the code? This does not say the code. Uh, one of the no, it was the other room that says the code. Damn you, scientists! Look, the only reason I'm so passionate about these things is because I know why you think that you just magically it's gonna work. Because I thought the same thing. That's the problem, though. It will never happen the way you think it is. That's how life works. It will never go the way you want it to. And that's life. Yeah, I thought- Oh, fuck! Mm. Yeah, I thought my parents couldn't tell me what to do when I turned 18. Exactly. Just because you're 18 doesn't mean magically you're an adult and things change. I'm 18 right now and I still do not know what the fuck is going on. I thought I was going to move out. I thought I was going to go to Drexel University. I thought I was going to be in Philly by now. Well, nope. Still back in the old neighborhood. Still living in the parents' house. Still fucking... Working a, a, a fruit-cutting dead-end job. The only little joys in life is when I see the manager that apparently cheated on his wife in the cooler of our fucking supermarket say that I'm doing a good job at my job. The fuck you want to go to Philly for? Because that's where Drexel is. I was going to live on campus on for Drexel, but then I realized, holy shit, my tuition's $200,000! What the fuck?! Uh, look, can I read it? Zero. Oh, I got them mixed up. Ah, uh, yeah, universities are scams. I know! But to be an engineer, you need to go to one, which is the worst part. And now I have to deal with some fucking boring ass lady teaching me math that I already know. Well, I'm in community college right now. Delaware Community College, baby! Gotta love the fucking online classes that I'm taking because three fifths of the classes are online. Which is good because I don't have to drive an hour to the school. Hello, good sir. Who are you, huh? You came here to get elevator keys so you can access the computer room. Yeah, I thought so. Well, then you're gonna have to beat me to get it. If you lose, your life is mine. You hear me? Mine. So what do you say? Challenge this chump. Mm-hmm. Hoo ha ha. You're mine now. And here we go, folks. The main event. The annual 66th Quirk Quiz. Yay! If you get five correct answers to the following questions, then you win, win, win. But if you get just three wrong, you're toast. You don't want to be toast, folks. Well, what are we waiting for, huh? Here we go. Question number one. Exactly what's hidden here? Monkey? Monkey! 
You sure about that? No. Monkey! Yeah, you're correct, crud. But that was an easy one. You won't do so well this next one. Now, question number two. What's the name of the girl in Pedalburg who's waiting patiently for Coop's return? Flavio! Ah. I'm not reading these anymore. <laughs> My voice already hurts. Uh, Goomba, Lava Bubble, and Buzzy Beetle, and Boo. How many feet do they have in total? Well, Goomba has two. Lava Bubble, don't imagine, have any. Buzzy Beetle has two. And Boo has none, so four. Okay, apparently not. Oh, no, he's a turtle. He has four. Duh. Obviously, I'm stupid. It's elementary... F Where was the one and only diamond star? Okay, Glitzville wasn't it. Poshley Sanctum was a shit brown... This wasn't one of the, this one was red. It's Hooktail's belly. Okay. And now question five. What was the name of the Prince Mush? What did Francesca and Frankie from Rope lose? A ring. A bling! Nice. I'm so mad right now, I can hardly see straight. I lose. I lose! Fine, but I really hate you. Take this, bum. Ugh. Thanks, buddy. I fucking love the music to this area. Odd security system. Yeah. But, you know, I mean, if it works, it works. Can't re I mean, it can't really complain if it works. <gasps> Ooh, I get my second fucking shot for the vac vaccine on Tuesday. Oh. <gasps> I can't wait to see how sick I'm gonna be on Wednesday. <laughs> it's gonna be fucking awesome! I'm hyped though. Be, a, be kinda annoyed if I had to answer a quiz if I wanna go to my room every day. Well, I assume that they know who you are. Right, I'm, I'm sure the guy knows who you are. Right, so then he's like, you know, he didn't he say, oh, intruder or something? Could be wrong. Could be. No, oh, fuck this. Fuck this room, man. Pure concentration. <sighs> Are you getting Moderna? No, it's the second shot of Pfizer. I can't complain if it works, but the thing is, it doesn't. It does work. It's just it. Mario had I, Mario coincidentally fit perfectly into the quiz questions he was giving out. If it was anyone else, it wouldn't work. But because it was Mario, it, it, it makes sense. I'm just gonna keep going back to CVS. I'm gonna see how many shots I can get. I'm gonna be fucking superhuman. 
sir, sir, are you sure you want your 17th one? Yes! Ah, oh, fair enough. I can't say what reaction you're gonna get. I got with Moderna was a sore arm for like three days. I know the first shot, my arm was pretty sore. Not, not pretty sore. I mean, it was like average soreness. I wouldn't say it's like super sore, but it was it was definitely sore. Fuck this room, man. Oh, wrong button. Fuck, I was trying the wrong button. I pressed the wrong button. Now I feel stupid. I have, I have string bean arms, so every injection injection hurts you. Oh. Oh. Yeah. It is nice to be able to have two turns. Holy shit. We take that bingo, ladies and gentlemen. We take that bingo. Boing. Boing. Yeah. That's one key card. That's second key card. That's the last key card. I assume I have to head in there, so we're gonna go down. It's already two o'clock, holy shit. Nah, it's fine, I've started working out. I'm gonna get buff and look like an angry swole hamster. I need to start working out. I am big. I weighed myself today for the first time in a few months and I'm the biggest I, I've ever been, I think. I mean, to be fair, I was about 200 pounds in 7th grade, so I was obese then. The difference is, is that I'm just slightly... I am technically obese now, but, like, it's on the cusp. But I need to work out. I've been meaning to work out. I worked out with friends, and then we just stopped... And it's hard for me to get into working out right now, because I just don't... Time-wise, I, you know, I, 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 I'm still working my mojo, man. I really am. Princess Peach? Oh, Princess Peach! You're taking a shower? Oh, my God. You sneaky little bastard. Try to fucking... I want to hit him with this. Sneaky little fucking bastard! Well, cut out the soda if you can and try to do calisthenics each morning and night. You only need like 10 minutes morning and night. I'll just work out like a normal person, I think. I mean, yeah, definitely the soda thing. But, I'll just work out like a normal person. I want to get buff too. The problem is, is I want to go to the gym, but I just don't know when to go to the gym. You know, that's the hard part. Okay, can't that can't go that way. Well, well, if you don't have the time to do it, then that will help. I guess you're right. I was cutting watermelons and honeydews today, and I had a really big knife. It almost looked like a machete, and it gave me it, it gave me so much fucking happiness to fucking cut these watermelons with these knives. Don't ask me why. I don't know. We have a thing called 24-hour fitness, which is pretty useful. Yeah, 24-hour fitness is really useful. I agree. I know the the gym I used to go to with my friends was 24 hour. That shit is really useful. Fuck you. 
They also had a stair climber, and the stair climber was my shit. And forever will be my shit. Love to see it. We're actually getting really close to another level up. The real question is, do I want to level up health or BP? Because, you know, we could get a BP. Sure. But then why would we need the BP? Let's be real serious for a second. Mm, we get another defend plus. If I do two, that could be fun. The guy from... What's TFS? Titty Foundation Systematic? Fuck, I don't... What? What's TFS? I couldn't think of a funny thing to say. Funny in quotation marks. Um... Oh, you know what? I know exactly what to do. I'm an idiot. Team Four Star, I suppose. What is Team Four Star? I've never heard of this. They did the DBZ Abridged series on YouTube. Oh, well, I have no idea. And I've never seen that. That is neat. One of the biggest flex I've always had was that I um, was on a Twitch stream with a YouTuber known as Wolfie Raps before he allegedly cheated on his girlfriend. I'm not sure if that's alleged. I, I, I'm not. How the fuck? You are so fuck. Okay, she was really tall there for a second. Um, and the real reason I thought it was so cool was because we were playing Overwatch. Him and the the Elbow Gang. As I believe his, his his team was called. And I was fucking destroying him. As Widowmaker. I don't really care about other people's loves lives. I mean, I don't care either. But, like, that ruined him. So that's that's the only reason why I said that. Like, I, you don't hear shit from Wolfie Raps anymore. But he was really popular. Also, I mean, cheating's kind of a douchebag kind of move, still. Yeah, it is none of your business. It's true. But, like, it gives an idea to their character, right? In my mind. But I guess people on the internet feel entitled. Well, I, I would say that about anyone. If I, if I learned that my fucking... Anyone cheated near me, I'd, I'd, they're a douchebag. One of my own friends that I know cheated on his girlfriend, and I I don't fucking talk to him anymore. He's a fucking he's that's it that's still an asshole move because uh, cheating on someone is like um honestly you know it's it's heartbreaking you know then then the people then the person has asked himself, am I enough? You know, and it's just, it's just it's just a bad situation all right all the way around. And I guess I care as much as I do because technically I was cheated on. Technically, 
I do only say technically because it kind of wasn't, kind of was. You. No. <laughs> Vivi, you need, you are too tall for that. <gasps> no, uh, I thought I was on the pipe. Uh, most definitely, but it's not like pro Jared issues where it turns out they were in an open relationship. And she said she she cheated on her when she was also messing around. Well, yes. That's understandable. If the guy actually has a reasoning to back him up, then that makes sense. I mean... Are you fucking kidding me? God damn it. Um, that's understandable. And I don't like to just take one person's word on it. Um, either. That, I... I kind of knew I was going to make that jump. Um, you know, that's it's it's very important that you take both both sides into account. You know? Like it was like let's say if it was an abusive relationship that you couldn't get out of. So, you know, you tried to do your best to get out and she wouldn't listen and then she was like, "Oh, you cheated on me." When in reality that never happened, then that's that's a different story. Like, "Oh, I, I tried. You know, I tried to get out of the relationship. I tried to tell her my feelings, but she wouldn't listen. That is an understandable thing. Exactly. I'd rather be told directly that I am not good enough for them. Rather than having to be worried about some shit. Some fucking childish shit where it's like, well, I want to be, I want to be with someone else. Do why didn't you fucking tell me that? And the amount of fucking damage that does to somebody. The amount of trust they need to build back up. I wasn't even fully cheated on and I'm anxious about it because of this same situation. It's fucked. It really is. God damn it, I have to get back up there. Shit. I fucking hate this room. Incredibly selfish. Even that in my mind is an understanding. People who cheat deserve capital punishment and torture. So bad that Kim Jong-un is disgusted. Okay, now that that's far. At the end of the day, they are people too. And I'm sure they had a reason for it. A lot of people cheat... Not to necessarily hurt the other person. They do it for self-pleasure. It's a selfish move. Right, but that it's not they need death. How the fuck do I get up here? Probably a pipe or something. I wish I could see where I'm going, though. No! God fucking damn it! Ah, fuck this room. Let me up! Well, how the fuck do I get it's, it's definitely like a pipe to get up there, right? I'm not crazy. That's what. No! Ah! Uh -huh. 
<laughs> the worst ro worst designed room in all of th all of Thousand Year Door. No, Mario! Oh my fucking god, damn it! What the fuck? What fucking bullshittery is this? Let me up! Um, can you level up in the a thousand can you can you level up in the hundred the the pit the fucking hundred pit or whatever it's called can you level up in that you can we have so many flying parts but they can't do shit I know fuck no get back up there Mario please <gasps> gonna jump off. It's probably the move. You know, I'm not even gonna risk it. Come here, Coops. Okay. But, okay, not a pipe. Just fucking magical stairs, I guess. Okay, cool. We can go with that. Sure. Wouldn't have been my first guess, but, you know, it, it's all right. Oh, fuck. I should probably change. Buh, 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 ha, ha. I've been waiting for you. Oh, man, I've been waiting. And I hate waiting. You. You've been uh, waiting. What does that mean? Buh, ha, ha, I'll tell you what it means. I used a crystal star to lure you here, so so that I could take all your crystal stars. How brilliant is that? Just make sure not to, to skip the rooms that can be divided by ten, because they have treasures, right? I relate to the purple man sub dump. I'm getting sex. I mean crump. <laughs> so Peach was here. Where did you take her, man? You fiend! Bah, 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 bah. Like I tell you the plan. That's a novice villain style. No, I won't be doing anything like that. Sorry, really, guys. So, ready for showtime? You guys are going to be perfect workout for the Venus Magnus von Grapple 2.0. Oh, it has a big old 2 on it. Plus, it doesn't have a cool intro where he just, like, throws an X on the screen. I think this thing is worse. God, fuck. Buh, 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 buh. Yeah, latest version of Buggy. So we made improvements. One, two, a dozen. Get ready for a whole new way to experience pain, you junior varsity losers. You're the one who's gonna be hurting, no matter how many times we do this. Coops, bad news? Get off the fucking team. His machine is... is German, but he is not. 70 damage? What the fuck is this, a cakewalk? Cakewalk.
<laughs> time to unleash some new sweet features. Wow, what sweet features. Ah! I mean, why, why should I not do this? It. Let's be serious. Is Katie here? No, I think she went to bed. I don't know. My phone's across the room. I can't tell if she went to bed or not. It's the only way my farn, my farn can charge consistently. Oh, what the fuck? That was cool. I don't know what it was, but it was cool. Damn, that was pretty bad. No! This is going pretty well. No, don't eat him! Ba, 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 ha. Eat this! Oh, fuck me! What the fuck? What the fuck? Dude! What the fuck? Get art attacked. I'm sick of your shit. How? That was one damage? That was three. I have to encircle the entire body. Sorry. Uh, how? Item! I should definitely heal Mario. If you had two defense plus, that attack would have dealt no damage. That you're right. You are right. Thunderbolt! Fuck you, go- oh. Okay, well, I mean... We'll just do normal jump on this guy, then. And then, to finish her off. Fuck you! Thunderbolt! Arrgh! I seriously didn't level up from that. That sucks. Groaders! Mario! You got the crystal star! Yes! Hip hip hooray! The last crystal star had been hidden in the x dot hideout on the moon. But by the time Mario recovered it, Peach had already been taken away. Where could Peach be now? And what of the elusive Grotus? Perhaps he holds the key to the remaining puzzle. Mario finally has all seven crystal stars. Where will they lead him next? The dozen you adore. Krem failed on his mission to collect, to protect the crystal star called the crystal star. But his objective was to fall. Fail, so that means he succeeded. Yes. It's kind of a win-win situation either way. Well, here we are. Now, where's the stupid Parsley Sanctum? A crystal star's there, right? So they say. Your putridness, and lo and behold, there it is, right behind you. Uh... 
Great, about time something worked out for old Bowser, in we go. I have some bad news for you, bud. I hate pipes. Who are you? Ah. Who the fuck are you? Oh look, my heart trembles. The fountain, so elegant. This is fine art of the finest. So observant as usual, my oh. My dear Gold Bob, indeed, surely this is artist art. Yes, dearest. One cannot measure as worth by coins. That is what art, what makes art art. And yes, the filthy rich always seek to find art with their ill-gotten coins. Yes, they seek to buy it. Yet, how can one appraise what the eye cannot perceive? Whoa. I don't even have a clue what you're talking about. You people scare me. Seriously. Write that down. Bowser is afraid of the rich. It's locked. It won't budge. Darn it! Whoa, baby, you're awesome! It opened! Talk about lucky! I guess rage really pays. Yes! This is it, Haggy. This is finally it. <laughs> At last, I've gotten my mitts on a crystal star. Yes. Impressive work, Lord Bowser. You're the absolute best stalking guy. You there, I have you now, villains. You are common thieves, aren't you? Mm, aren't you? My eyes never deceive. What are you implying? I'm no little thief, I'm... Um... Koopa Coot. I'm the great Koopa Coot. I'm taking this. Mess with me and I'll bore you to death. Oh, I see. Unfortunately for you, that's a red herring. Yes, fake. If you want it, it's yours. Wha what? A fake? That is the second fake star that has broken around Bowser. But look at this fancy display! The pedals doing everything, it's so pious! It's a f if it's a fake, then where's the real one? If you must know, I gave the real one to... Sorry, wrong, wrong voice. If you must know, I gave the real one to Luigi. Oh! You have to be kidding me. You mean... To, you mean to tell me that Luigi beat me here? Ah, those Mario Bros are the most annoying brothers of all time. Ah, how bothersome. The fact that we keep being outmaneuvered is disturbing. But where in the world could Mario and his brother be heading? Where? Maybe not in the world. Lord Bowser! <laughs> He's on his head. Oh, Paragoomba! Oh, sorry. Ah, Paragoomba! Why, why are we here so worked over? Tell me! Ma'am! Uh, the sir and ma'am! Mars collected the seven crystal stars and headed for the thousand year door! A what? The thousand year door? What the fuck is that? The thousand year door and unbelievably legend treasure is behind that door! Did you not fucking hear the beginning of this game, you fucking turtle? <laughs> well then, I'm going there immediately and I'm gonna ruin Mario! Hmm. Will you now, Luigi? Well done, lad. <laughs> Way not to fail. I like the fact that he knows who Mario is, but just continues to call him Luigi. Because he's referred to him as Mario. Because <laughs> Bowser only referred to him as Mario, so that means he knows who Mario is. He just refuses. We still don't know where Peach is. Well, let's head back to Rugpoor, right? Professor Franklin can maybe help us find Princess Peach. Oh, 
Hold on, quick pee pee break. I haven't done this in a, like a few days, it feels like. Who messaged me? I got a notification? Oh, we're getting an achievement. <laughs> okay. I'll be right back. Minute 30. How the fuck you got five ads? It was a minute and 30. Wow. Ad blocker like so rarely works though. And soup fan, it doesn't, you don't have ads because you're subscribed. You, that's why ad block doesn't work on Twitch. I don't agree with that first part. Adblock is, I mean, it's useful, but second part, yeah, you're subbed. That's why you don't have ads, but Adblock doesn't work on Twitch. It's <laughs> weird, I'm so sorry that you get so many fucking ads. I was a minute and 30. I didn't mean for you to get like 40 of them. Where are we? Oh. It's, I'm sorry. You are Mario, are you not? It is pleasant to meet you. I am the main computer of this fortress. I am tech. I must tell you something. That is why I brought you to this place. Princess... P P Peach, I am so, so sorry. Most of my data was uh, uh, erased, and my power were a unit was shut down. Now running on backup power with only cache aid memory, trying to stay operational. M Mario, you know that Princess Peach is not here, do you not? Please save Peach. Please, please. Princess Peach is with Grotus in the Shadow Palace. I had to tell you that. But backup power failing. Mara used the teleporter room to get to Roport. Teleporter room is on sub level two of Fortress. I will release the room lock. Peaches in the Palace of the Shadow. Please hurry. There's barely enough power to activate the teleporter. Oh, fuck. I, I will cease all AI functions to send power to the teleporter for you. But, but what will happen to you? When... The power is all gone. I will 
cease to exist as an artificial consciousness. But if it will save Peach, I will gladly do this. Because until I met Peach, I knew nothing of love. Do not worry about me. I am just a computer. Just a machine. Mario, you must save Peach. I ask you, please. And tell her. Thank you for me. We understand that. So hurry up to the teleporter room now. Mario, save. Why? When they went on the moon, uh, didn't they? Didn't know that there would be a tra transporter back to Earth. What went on their head to go to the moon with a cannon with seemingly no way back? That's a really good question, actually. Crash, are you doing okay? Fuck. Look at my fucking hair. I look like fucking Cindy Lou Who. I'm one of the fucking Koopa Bros, alright? I'm fucking Lenny. Of course I'm doing fine. I'm doing great. I'm doing great. Missing my word search. Okay, I fucking lost my prized possession of a word search. I'm doing fine. <laughs> nah, Cindy Lou who was adorable. Are you saying I'm not adorable? What the fuck? I'm the fucking cutest motherfucker around. A lot of emotions today. Mario, we have to save Peach for poor Tech 2. We just met him. He's a fucking computer. Why do we care about this fucking dweeb? Pretty sure making the AI would require more than work than manually doing it. Man. Wait. Wait. But the teleporter already worked. I don't think he needed to die for this. I could be wrong. It's, um, this one right here, I think. Well, when it's done, I would have an AI who will be in slave labor. I mean, AI is just a computer intelligence. I'm not sure what he's going to be able to do for you manually. I, I mean, I could be wrong. Peach. Goodbye. Holy fuck! The moon exploded? It's gonna mess the tides up. What are werewolves gonna do? Nothing? Uh, am, am, am I going totally nuts or did I hear something just now? You're fucking insane! La -dee -da -dee -da. Now to head back. Well, if it isn't Mario. I'm here, son. You brought the crystal star back from the moon with you, didn't you? What? Talking to my good ear, the Exxon Fortress at the moon? Ah, uh, yes. So Princess Peach was there too, I assume. Well, she was, but the Exxon boss took her and headed for the Thousand Year Door. Aha! Just a bit ago, I smelled some rank air and went to the thousand year door. Really? You're gonna. You use the word rank? Sure. Alright, no do this. I saw a suspicious fellow in a cape go through the door with a Princess Peach! What? 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 No way! Without the seven, seventh star? Uh, the door shouldn't open it, though. Believe me, I know, but I'm quite certain of it. I saw it with my own eyes. 
I have a bad, very bad feeling about this. Very bad. Princess Peach is in danger. Time is short. We must go to the Thazu door. Now! Go! You're... I don't know why you had to yell at me. I don't like him. I, I, I really don't. He's too loud. I'm very quiet. Why? Does he yell at you like this? Yeah, I just don't like him. What's up, hon? Oh, email. No. Please, I got yelled at by teachers and my mom on a daily basis. Okay, does it does that doesn't mean that you like it? What the fuck are you trying to say to me? What? <laughs> Just because you get yelled at doesn't mean you like getting yelled at. What kind of fucking stupid ass work around in your brain is that? I get yelled at a lot, so I look. So I like to be yelled at. Holy shit. Let's see what good shit he's got. Hammer man and jump man. Damn. Zesty clocks, Flavio. I mean, that is a funny one. No. What's up, Luigi? Alright, well now that we are officially done with the game other than the final chapter, so now we are going to begin all of the side stuff. Does disable both. <laughs> so you can't fucking attack? That's hilarious. Oh, no, I didn't want to sell. Let me see what the other badges are. I'm buying others. More damage. I mean, there's. I could get some of these badges. I don't. I. I, I don't know. The simplifier. I. I had it. That could make fucking infinity infinite bounce pretty easy. I think. I don't know. I don't want to buy them yet. I'm, I don't think I'm going to get all the badges. That just sounds like a fucking hassle. Okay, so now... You good up there, Goombella? Ah, she's fine. Um, yeah, so now... Everything's done. Except for going into the final chapter. Which means that... You know, because I've decided to... We're going to do all of the side stuff. Other than, like, the recipes and that stuff. And, you know, we got some stuff. We have, let's look. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23 more quests. We have the entire Glitz Pit left to do. And then we have the 100 pits. The 100, 100 trial. Let's go to the glitz pit. Let's go. Let's still go start the glitz pit. The I want to meet Luigi issue is kind of funny, so you can do it. Oh, by the way, when you yell at someone, hold your arm across your neck to scare them. To scare the other person into... F what? At someone, hold your arm across your neck. Wait. Okay, I'm waiting. What is it? Miss Kissy, you gotta, you gotta give me more context. You might as well take the trouble from Jolene if you're gonna go into the pit. Jolene. 
You're lame. Need some cleaning done. Oh. Okay. Well then, make a fist and aim it at the person you're yelling at. No, when you're yelling at someone, most times you're just angry. You're not trying to threaten them. And that's a threat. I mean, that's... That, could, that can get you into trouble. I do say. Let's go. Oh, you know what? This is we're actually gonna get. We're actually gonna win this right now. Oh, fuck! It didn't change. I'm sorry. Not to legitimately threaten them, just to make them scared that you're gonna hit them. Isn't that a threat? Isn't that literally a threat? It's an empty threat, yes. But it's a threat. Because you are threatening to hit them. And in their mind, they think they're going to get hit. But in your mind, you're not going to hit them. But you're making them think they are. Am I reaching here? So it's a, th it is a threat. Yeah, in Texas, they they could people can just say, I I do not feel safe and just start fucking wailing on people if I remember correctly. I believe there was an anti-masker video about that. We was like. I feel in danger! I feel like I'm in danger! And then we're just gonna just start fucking wailing. Which is... But it's an interesting law. There is an interesting law. I am in danger! Ah! Uh, he's making me put a mask on! Sir, we aren't making you do anything. We're asking you. L listen, you you keep coughing on this baby child. We just want you to put a mask on. It's just store policy. I am in danger. He's trying to threaten my rights. He's gonna try to take my breath away. Sir, that's not. That's not what I'm trying to do. I'm just trying to ask you politely to put your mask on. I feel in danger. I'm gonna fucking beat your ass. Sir, that, that's not necessary. I, I'll just walk away, honestly. I'll get my manager. Hold on! I'm in danger! Let me get my 45! Look, don't worry, though. People, stupid people are all over the place. I had some guy that looked like Nickelback... The Nickelback singer come into my pizza place and asked me why. Um, it, it told me to look at the statistics of COVID. But he said it in the way that's like, look at the photograph. Uh, it was, <laughs> I was like, bro, what the fuck? I felt so bad for a lady I saw in a viral video where a Texas woman attacked a waitress in New York because they wouldn't let her in the rush because she's unvaccinated. Yeah, it's people like that are fucking stupid. You accept the request? Well, fantastic. Let's get down to business. I need you to clear out the gar the garbage in the store room. I can't get anywhere near it. I have a problem with garbage. I don't talk about it. Just put it somewhere I can't see it. All right? Burn it. I, I don't blame on you for missing, but my previous message teaches you how you can get a Power Plus badge. Oh, sorry. Uh, use a save block, then adventure system clock. Return to the game, then repeat. Never talk to him again once you return the clock. Hmm. I'll just do it. I mean, I'll just get it luckily. L luckily. Oh, fuck. Oh, f oh, God. Shit. Oh, my God. This. Why, why did they put so many store trunks in here? Who the fuck is throwing their uh, dirty fucking shorts in here? 
What the fuck? Who is doing this? What the f- There's so many! What? I- I'm dumbfounded! We don't even have this many fighters! What the fuck? Is that all of them? And we're into that shit. It's true, I have seen many a XXX video of wi of women pissing in Target, and I said to myself, someone has to clean that up. What the fuck? I didn't look at it for pleasure. What the fuck? Cool. I didn't look at it for pleasure. It it interested me. I saw it. I was like, what the fuck? Fucking just peeing on a Walmart floor. And it's like, what the fuck? People have to clean that. What the fuck? It's terrible. There better not be underwear in here. There better not be a fucking scrap of underwear in this fucking piece. I think we're in the clear. That's just rude. Don't let your fetish inconvenience other people. Exactly! That's fucked up! Hey, Jolene. Oh, right. I have to actually get rid of it. The people my mom makes me hang out with left those boozers there. But Bo Boozers? The people my mom makes me hang out with left those boozers there. Left the the boxers. That's gross. Haha, <laughs> loser. No one's taking your trouble. I'm gonna sell the underwear. How much money can you give me for underwear? Nothing. You are losing out on a big fucking deal. I got 70 pieces of shat in underwear and you want some. Where's the garbage can? Not gotta sell that shit on dark web, yeah. Sadly, I don't think it's women's underwear. That shit would be eaten up faster than Mario could say wahoo. I don't like how those rocks back there look like a penis. You got a trash can in here? I'm gonna say that's probably a no. No on the trash can. Hey, you want some underwear? She wants to go back to Rogueport, but you can just start the pit. Oh, okay. What do I do in Rogueport? Do I just throw them on Goomba, and he's like, Oh, yes! I love it when the shit is on me! Is that the one? Is that what I have to do? Who do I have to throw it on? Is it Luigi? Oh my god, he's back. No joke, you give them to a guy who will buy them. Yes! Brett, look! It's your fucking... Your birthplace! Did you talk to her after collecting them? I did. She was like, you stink! Yes, they are separate things. I don't remember what she said. It's gonna tell me in the fight, though. Alright, so we got some battles to go through. This shouldn't take too long, though. Am I gonna do them all the night? No. That's what, um, Tuesday's for. You still have to follow the rules? Psh, I'm gonna follow nothing. I don't have to follow shit. It's gonna tell me. It's gonna tell me everything. It's gonna tell me everything I need. 
And it is Don't Change Partners. All right. Cool. Whew. That was a hard fight. Whew. I'm going to have to do that again? Holy shit. I've never actually gone through this again. So this is new. Whenever you get to the Super Paper Mario, there will be a two pits of 100 trials. I know. I was reading up on that yesterday. There's two pits, and one of them you need to do twice. And then there's another thing where you have to fight 100 samurai enemies. But that's basically it. Other than, like, the capture cards. Um, I'm not going to do all the capture cards, obviously, but... That's basically it. There's like, I think three hidden optional uh, um, pixels or whatever they're called. So, we'll, you know, we'll probably get them. One of them's annoying to get, but that's fine. Technically four? What do you mean technically four? It's... It's Piccolo, which is a funny name. Berry, Dashy, and then what's the last one? You have to beat the game now. Oh. Well, that's easy. Don't use my. How the fuck do you expect me to hit him? How the fuck do you expect me to hit him? I mean, that actually, that's a dumb question. I'll just do this. God fucking- It didn't even kill him! I- uh, Ah, what the fuck? Just defend. Wait a minute. Do you even do damage? He does do damage to me. One, though, but, you know, still damage. <sighs> oh, I gotta stop myself from doing that. I, li I literally have to stop myself from doing that. I, I, I can't hit him. I have to, I actually have to use this. Uh... Oh, you showstopper. Ab. I, d I can't see there. Mm -mm 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 -mm. X and B are the two buttons that I'm gonna. F that, that I always fuck up because they're always switched in my mind. Because of, um, PlayStation. Honestly. Yeah, good fucked. Art attack and the ground bouncing one works, yeah. It's Earth Tremble. But that's no problem. Um my new favorites become Showstopper. Showstopper's the, the, the fucking boss. I don't have to worry about how much damage they have. Or how much, um, things they got. That you want me to peel three times? What the fuck? What the fuck? Do you think Gubella's hair is natural? Or do you think she bleaches it? And then the question is, when does she have time to bleach it? Can you see the power you got from beating Vagnus? <laughs> Vagnus? <laughs> yeah, from Vagnus. No, not yet. We, I, it's, it's, it's kind of a waste. But then again, have I ever cared about wasting? Probably wears a helmet to cover her roots. It's probably why, honestly. I appeal it, it immediately gives me everything back. 
Eat an ass. Fuck it, I love- I love wasting things. Never even stood a chance. See, 15 damage is a lot, but if I just use... What, 3 FP? With my multi-bounces, I get the same. Love that you can hear the button mashing. I want to make sure that I at least get the best possible outcome. You know? That matters to me. I gotta do one special, one special move. Okay, I can do that. I can do that. What is diabolical about licks? Well, a lick is a is someone stealing something. Diabolical is just an adjective to say it's an evil steal, but in in a term, it's like. This is an absolute, you know, terrible lick. Like, this is this is so awesome. This is such a great thing. And then they pull out a projector. And at first I thought, oh, that's funny. And now it's become a crime. Now it's become, like, a, a big thing, a big problem. Use a special move at least once. A special move, you say? You say, I'm sorry, you said a special move? So what I'm hearing is, is that I should use sh Showstopper? Thank you. If I did something like that, my mom would get the belt on me. I mean, yeah. How the fuck? I think that bone is well deserved. Are you sure they're saying lick and not nicked? 100. Lick. It's it's like a TikTok thing. They're saying a devious lick. And they're not saying it's on just on the screen. It's like words. He said, I'm going to eat a fig, Newton, and no one's going to stop me. Well, these fucking devious lick TikToks are happening all over the U.S. I mean... It's become such an issue that TikTok literally had to ban like, hundreds of users that users that did it because schools were losing thousands of ten thousands of equipment. Entire bathrooms were destroyed. They were taking full blown sinks, toilets, fucking stalls. Yeah. And then you know, teachers' materials. Projectors, fucking computers, 
fire hydrants. One of a, one person broke a fucking um a fire alarm thing and Rich ripped it right off the wall, put it in the bag. Devious lick. It's a, a, absolutely devious. I'm eating another fig Newton. Fuck you. Fuck fucking Newton, baby. When you love the the fig. Well, maybe police are just too trigger happy. I'm, I'm telling you, the the devious lake thing is happening all over the U.S. It is. One hundred percent. Ew. I like how. I like how the um the camera just barely shows my fucking my mustache. It's just like a dark just slightly darker. It just looks like I have shit on my face. So a trend that negatively affects an industry I hate. It's not an industry. An in industry they they don't make something. They're trying to benefit you. Edu Schools are only meant to benefit the kid. Um, yeah, whatever. I'm not gonna get in this right now. It's three o'clock in the morning. I'm not gonna get in this. The crowd isn't useless. The crowd is what's giving me more star points. The bigger the crowd, the more star points you get. Plus, they serve as another... Like, a whole other aspect of the fight that you have to pay attention to. Like, when they throw rocks at you. That's an interesting mechanic in my mind. Like, that fucking bone right there? It's something you- another thing you just have to watch out for. And that... is beautiful. I'd like to at least get to the next level up, honestly. And then I'll... do a thing. Oh, Bobbery, his explosions will clear fog. Oh, I didn't know that. That's actually really good information to know. I got fucking money. One special move, you say? I can do one special move. A little thing called the the showstopper. Or the supernova if I'm feeling really dangerous. Fifteen damage is nothing now. I can do 15 damage in one attack, easy. Ah! 
Axa. Fuck, again, can't can't really work with that one. Nice. Only four more battles, and then we get a level up. And then I'm ending stream. Then I'm starting the, an, a stream of my own. It's a B. It's a B stream. You guys think it's just... Very close. For some reason, I thought this was going to take much longer. Like, I'm actually really far into this already. I forgot that... I didn't know that their damage was going to be exactly the same. I have to do 20 damage. Is that what, is that what it said? I don't remember. Some, some stupid. Do twenty damage. I could do twenty damage. Sure, we can do twenty damage. Sure. I'll show you twenty damage. I don't know. Why I have Goombella out. I don't really need her to be out. It said to do 20 damage, right? Win before taking. Oh, just win before. Okay. Alright, well. That was easy. Alright, sure. I'll win before I get to take 20 damage, sure. Damn, I'm gonna make it to the major leagues already. Might as well get bred out for the um the Clug Bros or whatever they're named. No, no hammer hits, no hammer moves. I think I read that right. Which is fine. I've been using jumps because they're technically more powerful, and I can hit more people with it. Well, t I guess not. Depends on the type of attack. I should just use Bobbery and he would fucking blow each one up individually. Like like how I died in Cortez's pit. Okay, they need to take this move away from me. Classic death. Listen! Listen! You did the fucking coincidence that it would have four big ba-bombs. It's ridiculous. Four of them! That was... Uh. That was a scripted death in my mind. It sounds like I can't change partners, but that's fine. Like, I need... Like, I've been using my partners anyways. Does Rockhawk have the same amount of health as well? Or is that different? Because if he has literally the same moves... Oh, my God. He's going to be fucking a cakewalk. I might just... You know what? I might just beat it all right now. Honestly. You... Supin. I already showed it. That was the supernova. I'm not doing it again. I sh I showed it to you. I actually did do it. Um I don't know why I thought that was going to do more, but it's fine. I have Stampede.
He's not going to. I don't need that garbage bullshit. All I need is my fucking... My... My two balls. And as my two balls, I mean Mario and Brett. They're my two balls. Imagine naming your balls after video game characters. How much of a dweeb do you have to be? Yeah, this one's Kratos, and this one... This one's Luigi! I mean, hey, that, that'd be an interesting combo. Kratos, the god of war, and Luigi. Hello! <laughs> Hi -o. Shao Kahn. No, that's, that's what the fucking peen would be called. This is Shao Kahn, the destroyer. And my testicles are named Luigi and Mario. Sh oh, dude, I remember Shao Kahn being the fucking coolest fucking guy in Mortal Kombat 8. He was so fucking cool. And then Mortal Kombat 9 had to really just fucking destroy him with Kenshin. Holy shit! The blind samurai dude. Holy shit. Alright, do your thing. Oh, fuck me. He's a child. I guess I haven't done this one yet. One yet. Fuck it. I'm gonna level up from this fight anyways. Yo, what the fuck? Oh, well. Damn, you really fucking collect a lot here. Holy shit! This is really good! Nah, that's a fucking... health. Yeah, leveled up. Fuck it, I'm gonna beat this right now. I... It, this has been really easy. I'm gonna do it. Should I, though? Yeah, fuck it, I'll do it. Might as well. Let me save before I'm, like, stupidly defeated. Uh, I guess I'll save again for when I'm not stupidly defeated. And what, uh, ten more fights or something? It should be a cakewalk. Uh, avoid switch. Okay, that's fine. Oh, we also need to collect all the star pieces. That's another thing we gotta do. Well, I guess we'll do that on Tuesday, though. Speed this up a little bit. If you no special moves, okay. How the winter is gonna be.
the fuzz. I want you to not fight. Do not attack at all. Oh. Okay, Mario can't fight. Okay, that's... I guess that's fine. Hey, wait. Better idea. Better idea. How many... Yeah, okay, I'm good on that. Percent for the fall, but I'm sad I can't do anything for Halloween. I get that. I think I've worked the past few Halloweens. Uh, no, that's wrong. I actually haven't worked the last two Halloweens. That's the opposite of what happened. Nope, sorry, can't attack. That's right. You want to trick or treat? I actually never. I stopped wanting to go trick or treating when I was like 13. Probably even younger than that. I don't know the real reason why, though. I guess it just didn't interest me. But now I'd love to go trick or treating. I love I love dressing up, and I and I would. Me and Katie want to dress up as a, a fun time. Last year, I she went as her Renaissance fair outfit, and I went as some guy from Persona 4, and then we went to this. Um, we went to, <laughs> we, we went to her, her friend's house who happened to be her old crush and her parents had a cow costume and I wore a cow costume and I had a sword. So it was pretty cool. The cow costume didn't come with the sword. I brought the sword, by the way. If anyone was curious. Are you serious, Bombery? You couldn't fucking handle that? You're getting subbed out for coops. to six. We're actually almost done. Uh, Magic Cooper, at least one switch move, okay. Switch Brat back. <sighs> uh, I gotta do another eight and a half hour shift tomorrow. Uh, pain in my ass. That is. Yeah. I mean, it's pretty, I mean, they, they, they're pretty easy. My mom started working with me, which is fine, but now her ass is getting more hours than me, even though I've been here there longer. Uh, I, don't know what to, I, don't know what, I don't know what to tell you, man. I wish I did. Does your mom work better than you do? Kidding, obviously, but I don't know. That's weird. I am tired. I want to. I just want to get this done, honestly. I forgot what she said, but then again, I didn't really look. 
Well, she has a car, so I guess she she's seen as reliable. Yeah, that's that's probably the biggest factor. Let's be serious. Don't you? Oh. Okay. This is gonna hurt him. Get fucked, kid. No jumps. Poor baby Brett. Oh, just because he was hit. <laughs> just because you're hit. Sometimes I forget I named him Brett. And every time I think about it, I'm like, that's fucking hilarious. I love the fact that I named him Brett. Because everyone's like, oh, you're going to give him a cool name, right? And I'm just like, Brett. It was no jumps, I believe it was. Just double checking, though. Don't use jump, okay. That was two experience points? What the fuck? Didn't- I didn't think I was gonna be spoiled! Who knew? Not me. Oh boy. What do you mean, oh boy? What's that supposed to mean? The fuck is that supposed to mean, Miss Kessa? What are you oh boying about? Are you telling me that there's a fucking difficult part of this? Do I have to fight Prince Mush? Two points. Oh. <laughs> oh, okay. Surprised. I, you know, they, they should make me do that. I want to see Prince Mush's fucking mush. Super Smackdown move. I like how the fire bro and the boomerang bro never come back. Uh, they're just only here. You, do you fight a toad in the um in the original game? Technically. Yeah, the master. You should be able to fuck up more toads, I think. Well, that was useless. <laughs> it does no damage to me. That's hilarious. Only toad, wo toad worth anything. Fuck this guy in particular.
This isn't gonna do anything either. Wow, I'm surprised I actually did damage. Imagine a blind person trying to play this game. They just, the, the, the noise, I need to stop using ground pound. The noises are very, very helpful. Damn, bro, really taking a beating out there. Let's try that one more time. Fucking, oh my God. Let me hit you! Jesus Christ! Fuck! What do you mean ground pound does jack shit? The fuck do you mean ground pound does jack shit? It does do stuff. It's just not against this guy. He has one defense. That's the problem. A lot of enemies don't have one defense. <gasps> Holy shit, two star points? What the fuck, am I the president? Yes. Ground pound does actually, it's six damage. It's a lot of damage. All right, now I gotta fight the metal dark knight or whatever his name is. Something edgy and stupid. Five turns. I can. I can do five turns. Also, we six hundred coins here. Pretty good. Why are you overlooking Power Plus, partner? What do you mean overlooking it? Not using it? I just don't need it. I don't care. I mean, yeah, for Yoshi, he would dex to do a lot. I mean, I'll give that to you. You know, who would do 12 damage? It's quite a lot. The difference is, is that, um, I already do enough damage by myself. I don't really give a shit. You know? Oh my god. Holy sh- the, the game could not handle that. Oh my god. The game- ooh. Ooh, that was bad. That was- Just about the worst thing I've ever experienced on that. Holy shit. What do I get for doing this again? I, I don't imagine anything. Just the title. I guess. That was one special move. I can do one special move, trust me. One special move shouldn't be shit. Oh, it stays in your inventory? That's neat. This is basically just replaying chapter three with none of the filler, and I think that's amazing. I'm happy that we get to play the best chapter twice.
I'm not, I'm, I mean, we're not really worried about Rockhawk. Use its special move at least once, okay. I, I mean, that's just 15 damage. Like, it's useful. I just... I guess I don't care that much. <laughs> There's no way this is gonna work. There's no way this is gonna work. If this works, holy shit. That'd be so fucking funny. There's no way. Okay, if this fucking works. <laughs> oh, fuck. <laughs> okay, okay. Whew. <laughs> All right. Oh, I had me worried there for a second. Nah, I was worried. I was worried about that. But we're good. Ground Pound, get in there. I think he has one defense. Oh, no, he doesn't. Wow. Well. That's surprising. He doesn't have one defense. Be a surprise to me, but it's all right. Oh fuck! I messed that up because the game lagged a little bit. That was, that was so cool, man. You're also dead. Wow, six whole FP. Or star points. Wow. In total, I got 34 star points from doing all of this again. I don't even care about this. I just want to. I just want to. I just want to be able to save. I love the I love the painting of me. I do really like that. It's a nice touch. Nice. All right, let me go. <sighs> save the game. Actually, let's just head to Rogueport. We'll head to Rogueport. We'll save there. And then we're gonna call it a night. Tomorrow's a pretty big night though, because you know, other than me working and doing all that stuff, tomorrow is a huge night because. Oh, fuck. Get the fuck away from me. Um, because tomorrow we're going to start Luigi's Mansion 3. And I, as I've said many times before, I have no idea anything about this game. Um, so it's just really exciting because, you know, never played a game. And we're going to play it on stream and it's going to be completely blind. I'm, I'm super excited about it. Get all these fans away from me. I hate my fans. I fucking hate my fans. <laughs> nice. So that's one of, like, the four things I wanted to do. Now all we have left is the Pit of 100 Trials, which probably won't be too bad. Then we have all of the side quests and the star pieces. Honestly, maybe one and a half streams. You know? And then... That was weird. And then, um, we move on to the final chapter, so maybe three more streams in total of this game. Maybe four, if it takes me long. So, got about another week. 
Where in here do I throw the fucking underwear away? I know I have to go back to her. Where do I do that? Oh, right, right, right. Someone, someone, I, someone wants to buy it off of me. You know what? I think I know exactly where you're talking about, actually. It's back here, isn't it? It's this guy. Oh. The Goomba in front of the power-up wizard? Oh, well, no, that's not fun. What, 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 what? Other than the star piece that's in that room, what, what, what does that room even do? The fuck? You. Are you fucking kidding me? Are you- are you really fucking kidding me? I have to select each and every one of them individually? He stole your coins at the very beginning of the game. You could have gotten them back. What do you mean, gotten them back? Alright, then we have to go back talk to Jolene. But we'll say I'm not going to do that now, obviously. Um, all right. Just can you guys do me a favor? If you guys can remember. Um, remind me to go back to Jolene when I play next time. Well, probably tomorrow. What the plan is, is that next time I play this, um, we're going to do star pieces and side quests. Probably. What, one of them first. I don't know which one. And then after that, we'll do the Pit of a Thousand Trials. Okay. We save one more time. And... Okay, why, am I, why is my shit fucking all tied together? I hate that. How the fuck did that even happen? Like, my shit's somehow knotted around the... I'm... I'm kind of impressed. We're good now. All right. It has been saved. All right, everybody. I hope you guys had a great time. Tomorrow, we're going to play some Luigi's Mansion 3. I hope I see you all there. Have a great night, and uh, I'll probably start tomorrow late. I get home. Uh, hopefully not, obviously. But, yeah. Hope you enjoyed. I'll see you guys next time. Peace!